make you want a Reese's? How about this? Okay, we'll stop. Just kidding. We're not gonna stop. Not sorry. Reese's. Make you want a Reese's? How about this? Okay, we'll stop. Just kidding. We're not gonna stop. Not sorry. Reese's. Make you want a Reese's? How about this? Okay, we'll stop. Just kidding. We're not gonna stop. Not sorry. Reese's. Squeaky chair. Magic afternoon. Hope you guys are doing all right today. God, uh, I'm not. Afternoon. I'm ex exhausted. Are you exhausted? Why am I always effing tired, man? Mm. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't get to see you at uh at nationals. That's there. That's who you met because you couldn't remember. Okay. Uh, so I can, yeah, I remember we're we're gonna talk about we'll talk about it right now and then we'll talk about it during uh, Magic After Dark too. Uh, Josh comes up to me in like my round. What do you think? Four. Yeah, oh, I, was like, I, met, I met somebody that watches the show. I was, you, I was so pumped. You're, you're like, I met somebody that, and, and I had to come find you immediately. You tell yeah. you, and I was like, that's so fucking cool. Did you take a photo with him? And you're just like, oh no, <laughs> I didn't think about doing that. And I was like, Shut do you remember mouth. their name? And he's like, oh no. <laughs> Josh was so like reverse starstruck. He was just like, oh my god, somebody actually came up to me and said, hey, I like your show, and like you just became. I don't think he said I like. I think he said I just watched you guys. <laughs> It's like a, it's a fucking train wreck. It's it's amazing. It's like, what, do I watch Mori Povich during the day, or do I watch Chris and Josh play awful fucking magic? That's right. Mori is telling people right now that they are not the father. That's fucking hilarious. Oh, that's super cool. I was a little jealous. I was like, man, that's that's so cool, Josh. Yeah. And I was asking him so many questions what I should have been playing. It was really bad. Okay, but today we are Going back. We are back from um, from vacation with the the holiday mm -hmm. and nationals and all that stuff. Yep. And so uh, we're back for a magic afternoon, and we have our it's a it's a it's fun week. It's casual. It's week. casual week. 
it's get a deck that has some pieces for modern and build up later yeah. week. And uh, this week we're on blue white tutelage turbo fog. Even though there's not a single fog in this deck, there are only fog like effects. There's like there's lots of fogs. That's a fog. These are all fogs. Fog is green. It was, it's a green card. None of these are green cards. Although many people were telling us that we should add green, and we're just like, <laughs> do you see how many fogs we have? Yes, yes, Richie. Uh, watching this, watching us stream today is going to be like watching two old people fuck. It's yeah. going to be. It's gonna, just going to be like. It's going to be. What do we do? I don't turn. know. Just draw the turn. Just draw a card. All right. So uh, so let's get into it. Um, I want to I want to talk about this <laughs> this great deck. Uh, so we'll start with the mana base. Um, you got your basic um, blue white package here. Hollowed fountains. Um, oh, <clears throat> I don't think uh, if we run into like blood moons, we're probably we're really not probably we're super fucking dead because we're only running uh, four basics and, we have and no, no way to get them. No fetch lands. Like the only way to get them is to ghost quarter one of our own lands, and I In don't response. know. Yeah, so like they go blood moon on the stack, you go ghost quarter your own land. Okay, that's you go pretty get a basic. I like that. I didn't even think about that. But like we have these colonnades, why are they just not? fetch lands or why are the glacial fortress just not mm. fetch lands yeah i think the i don't know but we put like we do with all the decks we put this up on the mom's basement game mm -hmm. facebook uh page and mm -hmm. we said hey how do we improve upon this yeah and people had suggestions for the rest of the deck which we then did a little bit of and then we completely fucked the rest we'll get to that but nobody said anything about the mana base so we just were like it it must be good I guess. Yeah, I mean, I could have, I could have took three minutes to look at this beforehand, but oh, I was so, I was just like, oh, thanks, Richie, thanks for asking why no fetches now, buddy. Because <laughs> so, before you were like, hey, just add fog. I'm excited. I'm excited to uh, see if this card actually works, but I think it's like one of those. I think it's one a win in ten. More. No, I think it's like a one in ten. Um, because kind of kind of game, and I think we're we're only gonna play five rounds. So. In in order to activate, that's funny. One in ten, we're only gonna play five rounds. The shell dog oil. You have to have somebody with less than twenty cards in their in their library. Mm -hmm. I feel like that's just win more. I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see. Um, okay, so the mana Ooh. base we have uh, we Excuse have our secondary me. wing con with celestial colonnade. Um, so maybe we'll get there with that. Um, we have our you know a regular package of angels grace, and we're we're bringing this in against. Well, we're we're gonna play it main board so that we don't lose to storm. Hopefully, yeah. Um, so we've got two of those in the main. Uh, we're playing Ethereal Haze. That's, you know, your basic fog for creatures. It's the real fit, the fog um, of the deck. Yep, Holy Day. Same exact card, just uh, just different name. And then we've got our one of Elixir of Immortality so that we can, you know... Rebuy all of our fogs. Yeah, and hopefully this buys us a little time against maybe those super fast decks if we need to pop it off early. Gain a little bit of extra yeah. life. I mean, even against Burn, this might be enough to, to keep not. us alive. It's not. This plus some fogs? Yeah, maybe. You're right. Maybe. Uh, Angel Song, this is really actually... I, I think this is going to be really good because we can cycle if we're playing against, like, you know... I, I think this is two-mana draw a card. <laughs> yeah, this is going to be... Most of the time. Yeah, this is going to be two-mana draw a card. Um, and then we've got our Dawn Charms. This is pretty cool. Um, this is going to be our, our Burn Hate. I didn't even think about that. Look at the last one. Counter Target, target spell, spell that targets, targets you. you. Yeah. I'm more oh, excited baby. to regenerate target creature. Yeah, I want to. I want to regenerate. <laughs> I want to regenerate colonnade. I'm serious. It's gonna be fucking. It'd be sweet. pretty good. You activate it, go to swing. They go to like blow it up or something like that. No. And you're like tapping it in response to fucking I, regenerate. Yeah, I want. So do nothing for the turn. Here's the glory. Here's the glory story. Right. So, uh, somebody goes to ghost quarter or field of ruin or, or colonnade. We oh activate my god. It. We activate it. And then we regenerate and then we it. dawn charm and regenerate it. Oh uh, yeah, that would that would work, oh, baby. Because it's just, it's a destroy effect. Uh, There's only one of these. There was two in the original, but we needed to cut something. So yeah, one of pollen uh, pollen lullaby. It's it's a it's a clash card. Clash is, weird. Clashing is weird. Clashing is very weird. Um, we got our four howling minds in here. We had four temple bells, but we we moved down to uh, two. Because we needed to make a cut for... No, we didn't need to make a cut. We needed to make a cut. You shut your fucking mouth. <laughs> we needed to make a cut for Staff of Nan. And I said to Chris earlier when I got here, I said, um, in my head, I said, listen, if we're going to be playing... <laughs> I said to Chris in my head. We're, if we're going to be playing this awfully awesome deck... This is the only spot where we're ever going to be able to play Staff yes, of Nan. Yes, I'm going to get to play... I actually heard one coming out of your head. I'm playing Staff of Nan. So I just want to shoot... I just want to shoot somebody to death with this thing while we fog them. Oh, that's kind of funny. I didn't think about that. Yeah, I used to do this in standard. It's 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 a it's a blasty. Uh, we got our two verdicts in the main. 
Uh, and then, of course, uh, we, we split the, uh, the old Wrath of God on the sideboard so that we can have game against humans. Uh, it's not like we don't have already enough game against humans. Uh, we've got our Dictator Crew Fix. Uh, this thing is a, a really three-drop flash. Yeah, this card's nutty. Um, it's Howling Mine, but on crack. Mm -hmm. um, because you get to flash it in, and it gives you you know, it gives you know that extra card draw, whereas they get that card draw. Right. We needed the yes. Staff of Nin. And here is our win con. So Sphinx's is Tutelage. This, this is a card I played in Standard. If this gets surgically extracted... Tell that to see fewer notifications. I don't care about... Oh, damn you, Close. Microsoft. All right. So... If we get if this gets surgically extracted, we are fucking oh. fucked. Oh yeah. Well, we got the staff of death. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. We'll just shoot I, I love this card, man. So this was um, a fun card. Yeah. It's got good art. It's, this one was a fun one back in standard. Yep. Yeah, so this is the basis of the deck, um, and it's really cool. So mm. I'm excited. Um, we've got four mm. ley lines on the side, which I think we have to aggressively mull to in some matchups. Yep. Yeah. So these are going to be. I think these maybe somewhat pivotal today mm -hmm. um this is disenchants are for our um our early eidolons or our um we don't want to i mean i guess stony silence isn't going to be that bad now that that we cut temple bells but uh other ley lines you uh, also other ley line uh, of sanctity the blood moon yeah, blood. So blood moon, ley line of sanctity. Those are what we what we're really worried about. Because our stuff targets our opponent as well. So we yes. need to be able to yeah, do Sphinx's that. tutelage says whenever you draw a card, target opponent mills the top two. Yeah, so target is the key. So yes, that's you know. It's just I don't know if anyone things. will be smart enough to to bring in ley lines against us, but we'll see. Yeah, uh, we got our Burton Forge Tender, obviously for our uh, our old good old burn matchup, mm -hmm. and you know this thing just might get there. You're going to have... Like, I'm bad with this card. I'm legitimately bad with this card. I always don't... I'd rather play other things. So this is a, this is one of the cards that you have to show yeah. me how to probably actually should, run. We probably should have played Core Firewalker because then that thing... No, don't... don't <laughs> I think someone that suggested that one. And we could just beat people down, but we can get there with one. Yeah. We can want them to death. Um, yeah, that's we, got, we got the staff. We got, th we got three negates, which... Straightforward. Uh, and we've got three relics because... Uh, our control matchups probably going to be difficult, so uh, we don't need them snapping back cryptic command. Yeah, um, I think it just gives us. It's kind of a fog against Tarmogoyfs as well. Yeah, Group yeah, players, it'll, yeah it'll, it'll slow. It'll slow them down. Um, okay, so you ready? Well, let's do the thing that we do where we do like three oh, to five hands? tester yeah. hands. So what tester you do hands. is you go to the little gear there, mm -hmm. and I think it, I think it gives you an option for sample hand. Ooh, baby. Um, that's keep. Like right, it's so. got it's got lands. <laughs> <laughs> it's got lands and fogs. It's got lands and fogs. It's a keep, right? Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's see another hand. Uh, let's do like like four or five of these. Okay. Yeah. Oh, uh, that's a keep. <laughs> this is all keep. So we're it's, never gonna mulligan it's, with this it's guy. one land, three fogs. We can cast three other things in here. Draw a card. I want to see. Draw another card. Scroll over. Ah, should have been a mulligan. You got another dot chart. Okay. Okay. Oh no! Yeah, that's it. Uh, that's a really good one. Yeah, that's, that's a super. A good hand. Yeah, that's a super good hand. One more. Let's see one I more. I hope we draw Angel's Grace all day. Yeah, Angel's Grace will be good. All right. It's it's our worst fog, I think, and but it's we, but it's a tricky fog. So we got card we got card draw. We mm -hmm. got card draw. I like that's it. actually really good. Uh, yeah, that's fine too. That's okay, great. wow. All right, let's let's get yeah. into it. We've seen the sample hands. Okay, good. We've used all the good ones. So <laughs> play lobby. All right, let's do it. Let's get in here. Yeah, I should probably put mine on that silent as well. Um, we want the constructed d d d tournaments. And we want leagues. And then select the deck that we're playing, which we've called Tutelage Turbo Fog. Which, by the way, we got the, the gist of this um, from MVP Saffron Olive over, or better known as, or Seth, better known as Saffron Olive. You always do that. Over at MTG Goldfish. Yep. All right, so where are we going now? Oh, I thought did you you selected that uh, competitive modern league? Okay, so we're about we're about to actually pay money to do this. Yeah, join the league. Oof, sorry, some guy that's destroyed everybody. Kentucky special kills me. Yeah, we want to pay twelve tickets to get our fucking faces pounded into the dirt. <laughs> Hopefully, quickly. No. There's a lantern of insight I need to pick up today. Play, play league match. 
Why do I have to click that again? I don't know. I don't know why your window's <laughs> tiny either. <laughs> That's what he said. Why did he say it? <laughs> oh! <laughs> mm-hmm. Very good. Very good, sir. So where'd you put us all out today? You said you were gonna you were gonna tweet us and all that stuff yeah, so and I'd, special yeah. Michigan groups or whatever. Oh no no no! I'm gonna do that later for our, our pack giveaway. Oh, because our pack our pack give our pack giveaways tonight. Don't forget that. You should do that around nine o'clock then. Nine ten. No, o'clock. I'm gonna do it at f- like three because that's when like three p.m. When... Oh, you're gonna forget. It's almost two right now. I'm gonna do it at five when we're done. Doing I'm not gonna this. remind him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna do it at five. Yeah. So, uh, but your your it, Facebook group is starting to challenge the number of people in the uh, Michigan calendar group. Yes. Michigan so, Magic Calendar Group. Yeah. We're uh, six hundred people or something. Yeah. We got a uh, five eighty six. Join match. Something like that. So, yeah, I'm pretty excited about that. We're growing. You're doing it, Peter. I'm doing it. Uh, Peter. It opened in another window for some reason. Yeah. Click that. No photo. <laughs> oh. And then full screen this. Yeah, baby. Oh, Josh, I love you. Priority received. Waiting for me to respond. Oh, I think this one... I'm keeping this all fucking day. Okay. Oh, God, that's bad. The staff and in. I just want to play like, with the well, staff and in. I know you only want to play with the staff and in, but look. Tap. We, we can play the Howling Mine, and we can play the one uh, Dawn Charm. You cannot play the Dictate. You have to draw another blue source. We don't have a lot of untapped blue sources. You can't play the verdict, and you can't play the staff. All right, we're on the draw, so let's mulligan. Okay, we're You're on right. the draw. That's that's a good thing to notice there. Uh, you got the fucking staff again. Yes, we're keeping this one. That's okay. This is okay. Yeah, oh, that's baby. that's fine because now we can play the dictate. We only have one fog though, so this person is gonna sit there. They're gonna see the elixir and retire. They're gonna be like, "What the hell is going on?" <laughs> They're gonna go. Oh, this man. is competitive magic, right? Turn one. I hope we run to, to KCI. Yeah, get ready to get back into the clicking, Josh. Yep, 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 yep. yep. Colony tapped. Colony tapped. F6. Or regular six. We got this. Hmm. He did not crack. It's fetch. That was a hiccup. That hurt. Glad we didn't get Terminus on two. <laughs> that would have been awesome if he just revealed it. No, he wouldn't do that. No. Right, so um, what do we play here? Just play, we play the, Glacial Fortress tapped. Yeah, we play the Glacial Fortress. Do we want to? I don't think we want to play the Elixir here because he could just counter it. Yeah, and we don't have another one. He's not gonna counter it. Okay, I'm I'm on board then. Let's he's do it. He's not gonna counter. Let's it. do it. He's he's just gonna logic dot it for one. You think so? <laughs> that would be amazing. Yeah, I want to see him do it. I want to see him crack this this flood of and then go logic dot one. Yes, we're no, on board. No, we're on board. there's no way, dude. When you're in a competitive league and you see someone go elixir as their first play, <laughs> you can't let that go. That's dangerous. You're just like, what the hell is going on here? You don't know what your counter spells are gonna do. Mm. You have priority, bud. I can't wait until we fucking play staff and then. Um, Ooh, they yeah, they missed a land drop. Yeah, this is good. This is really good. So on their end step, we're gonna flash in the dictate, and they're gonna let it go. Because they obviously need to draw more cards. Six. Yeah. We want to just make sure you don't six on their turn. We don't care if they cast something here. Because. Yep. Oh. Hard okay. Cast, that's, hard cast and a snap. That's uh, that's an ambush viper. That's a yeah, blue ambush viper. I'm okay with you opting. He may opt. He's looking for a land. Yeah, he is. Did he get there? Nope. Uh, no, don't fuck. I'm just <laughs> no, <I'm not> <laughs> don't you fucking fuck. I'm not. This is actually probably a really bad matchup, right? Because he just starts countering our fogs when they batter. Okay, dictate. Click the dictate. Blue. Uh huh. Blue. Uh huh. Colorless. <gasps> Colorless. Yeah, he's he's just like what the hell. All right, let's draw extra cards. So at the beginning of each player's draw set, that means we take the game action where we draw our card for turn, and then we resolve our trigger, and we draw off of the dictate. What the hell is he doing? Is he going to vapor snag our... It's, oh. The trigger's on the stack now. Yeah. He's going to... What? Okay. I don't think we care, right? There's nothing we can do no, anyways? That's we don't fine. care. Okay. Go get a land, buddy. <laughs> This guy's getting real desperate. Yeah, he is. 
He needs that other island. Okay, so play a colonnade. We can't play the staff. And we just pass turn, right? Uh, I think we... Do we fucking ghost quarter his... <laughs> <laughs> no, because then he goes and gets a planes anyways. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, just let it go. Alright, let's six our way through this. Alright. Bye-bye, oh, son my bitch. God. This is really cool. No, it's not. I'm, I'm <laughs> it's really not cool excited. at all. This, I'm really excited. This is the fucking goofiest shit. Why is this in a competitive league? I'm so excited right now. I don't give a fuck. I, it would have been better if we had just either of us taken a couple reps with this deck. We have no idea what's going on. We're, we're, we were on vacation. Yeah, last week. We got a Dawn got Charm. This. We drew. Let's draw. Another Dictate. That's hot. That is super hot. He missed his land drop again. All right, let's fucking murder this guy. It's past turn. Does he have any counter spells besides um, cryptic? Maybe that targets us because it's target opponent taps the the creatures they control. Is that right? Makes him choose. Yeah, he's gonna start pathing more snapcasters. <laughs> Hold on, don't don't six here. Okay. Um. Oh jeez. Yeah, we'll go. Yeah, we want him to draw a card. Yeah. Oh, so now he has a steam. Here it is. So now we could go score to that. Not this turn, though, obviously, because he'll get the land right now. You didn't want a Dawn, dawn Charm? Nope. We have to start using these things because we have to get around some of his counter magic. Let's 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 Holy Day. Prevent all combat damage? Yeah. Okay, sure. I think the next time he goes to target you with something, though, you don't charm. Okay. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Oh, don't. don't. So, yeah, I got to cast the, dis I gotta cast Dictate. <laughs> this is so stupid. All right, cast the Dictate. Oh, my God. This is really fucking awesome. This, I don't care what anybody says. This poor guy. I feel so bad for him. He's only got four. Oh, counter. Watch that. Yep. Yep. Hard times when you're counter and dictating groupings. <laughs> so I think he's got maybe one more of those. Oh, he's tapped then, out. Yeah, cook. He's tapped out. We need to draw a land so we can cast staff in I know, I know, I know. Oh! It would be really good. It would be really good. Here, just don't pay for the Lodge Knot. No, I don't want to pay for the Lodge Knot. Good, dot. good. Oh my God. So funny. Oh, God, please draw a land so we can play staff in An untapped land. You know, like a fetch land. <gasps> this is actually perfect, too. This is our win con. All right. Oh, no. You have to play the 6 2 to this, Josh. I'll never get to play the staff. I don't though. care, Josh. You will. I promise you will. You have to play the actual wing con. Play play the ghost quarter. Let's uh, let's just fucking double court, ghost quarter his ass. Um no, Does he play. run a does he run a, a mountain? Probably. All right. Let's play the Sphinx tutelage. Um cuz we need to we need to keep white up. Yeah, we might have to keep bolt. two white up. So, and then maybe put, yeah. Yeah, I think that's right. And then, I don't know if we ghost quarter. I think we if we're going to ghost quarter him, we do it on his upkeep. Okay. Uh, so you have to set a stop at his upkeep. You have to right click on that. And then stop an opponent's turn. I'm not saying we have to actually do it, but... We should probably so if you want to do it, now's your now's your opportunity. I don't. You don't want to. I don't because I want to. I want to be able to cast staff and in. But we're gonna be drawing a lot of cards, aren't we? No yeah, more. yeah. We're about to draw some cards. All right, let's go, Squatter. Okay. Um, what happened? Okay. That was weird. Didn't look like it targeted properly. I got you. Nice try. <laughs> All right, so let's check and see what this thing says again. Yeah, what's Whenever you say? draw a card, target opponent puts the top two cards of his or her library into, into their graveyard. Don't bounce. Don't if they're bounce. both non-land cards that share a color, repeat this process. Okay, okay. Uh, oh, baby. Hold on, hold on. Return its... What was the second one? Is this Return just... target permanent to its owner's hand. So the other one must be draw? So we can stop that. No, game. because it has to target us, right? It's, Car it target permanent to oh, its, its owner's hand. So what does it say? Target spell that targets you? Target spell that targets you. It's not targeting us. Whatever.
That's fine, I guess. Yeah, we, we're okay with this. Fuck you. <laughs> this guy's playing from behind. He didn't have a... He didn't have a, uh, a red source, by the way. He doesn't have a mountain. Yeah. Did he go get an island? Did he not get a plains? Uh, I think you let this one go, don't you? No. Fuck it. Smog. Okay. You gotta use these things. I mean, we do have a lot of them, right? Yeah. You good? Uh, yeah. We don't want to. We don't want to cast anything. No. Nope. Just want to draw cards. Yep. Sphinx's tutelage. Another one. Give us a win. Oh, yeah, gosh. okay, how's this work? I don't know, let's what cast it. it. <laughs> Fine, let's do it. <laughs> we'll see what happens. All right, so ETVs, it's tapped. And then we look at four cards. Um, What's the pollen? Is the pollen just another... Prevent all combat damage. Um, Prevent all combat We want to cast... We want to cast... We want to put an angel song under there. You want to put another fog under there? Yeah. Okay. And then any order... Um, I think we want to slam both tutelages because he's going to counter one with his other logic knot and one of them will stick around. And this will be his undoing. Wait, do we have enough mana for this? No. No, because of the shell lock isle came in tapped. Well, yeah. try and cast one anyways because we've got nothing else to do. Yeah. You cracked that flooded strand, bitch. <sighs> bitch! <laughs> Oh, we're, we gonna, got a we're, so, we're so gonna go to time. What's he playing? It's gotta be another knot, because he's like delving stuff now. It used to show like what they were clicking on and stuff like that, but I think they stopped doing that because they didn't want to actually confirm that they had a delve card in their hand. Because uh, you could obviously cancel and choose not to cast it. Uh, no, we're not going to pay four. Yeah, I know. I just clicked one. One, one is always okay. Doesn't work on no. Yeah, it's not, it's not the no option. And, uh... Six. Yeah. You need to right-click on the upkeep thing again. And then remove the stop on his turn. I think that you can't fog this turn. We have this elixir. We're doing fine. Sounds good. We're definitely bringing in the relics. And I don't know what else. The gates. What the hell is this? Oh god, he's tapping six mana. Six this is, is good for us. Six is rough. What's happening? Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. We don't want to respond to this. There's nothing we can. <laughs> you want to do? <laughs> I want to be sad. So he's gonna draw a card on top. Oh no! Wait, oh, Josh. What? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know when you click through it. He just he just tucked our our thing. No, don't fog here. Don't fog. Take two. Hmm. There should be a pithing needle in this deck. You're not, right. Not playing one of my favorite cards for some crazy reason. Okay. Well, you gotta cast that Sphinx of Tutelage. But you gotta get out of combat. Man. What the fuck? Why am I in second? Okay, man? now you're in second. Man. Well, you hit it. Okay. Uh, blue. Use the shell dock because we're not. Because it's gotta be under 20. He's at blue. 34. White. Casting C's to the leech. And here's another situation where do you wanna ghost quarter him in his upkeep or no? Um, you wanna get rid of the white source? Oh, well, no, you can't. Because you passed the turn. Mm, yeah, I don't care. Dude, why didn't we just activate Colonnade and kill his fucking Teferi? I don't know. Why didn't you do that, Josh? <laughs> oh, boy. I mean, what land did he have up? Did he have just the Holophone? He had zero land up because he... I think mm. he, no, no, I think he had he could have had Path up. Wow, this is getting real annoying. I don't think we can do anything, right? No. All right, there it goes. Back to the hand. Yeah, I guess we should have uh, colonnaded it. I think we're still gonna. I think we're gonna do that this turn, right? Yeah. You want an angel song here? Um. Yeah, angel song or cycle it. One of the two. Like either or is fine. We have this elixir. Let's just take the two and cycle it. Okay. 
It might, it might have been worth trying to get him to cast a counter spell. He's not going to, though. No. Um, cycle now, just to be safe. Uh. Oof, I almost fucked that up. I was a little scared for you there. I almost fucked that I almost cast an Angel Song. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been so bad. <laughs> I would, have, I would have had to quit. I would have had to be like, no, we're done for the day. <laughs> Thank you so much for Log watching. Logging off. God, Teferi is so good. Okay, so what can he do? He's played two cryptic commands. He cannot cast a third one with a snapcaster. So we have to just play around him not having the third cryptic command and attack with the celestial colony. You think so? I mean, he could path it. Oh, he could path it. He's definitely going to path it. We can't do anything about that. We don't have the stuff for it. Yeah. I just say we just play out our shit. We got one, two, three, four, five, six lands. We can play out. We, we can play that and then play that on his end step. Or, well, before his end step. Before his Teferi untap shit. Yeah, let's go Howling Mine. Or no, let's go Sphinx. Sphinx's Tutelage. Yeah, let's go Sphinx's Tutelage. No. Let's play. Let's hard cast dictate and then play it second main. What are you gonna do? What are you talking about? I want to hard cast. Whoa, dictate. Slow, slow down, slow down. You want to cast a thing with flash in your turn? Why? To draw the counter spell for the Sphinx's tutelage to land. To draw the counter spell. Draw out the counter spell. Oh, draw out the counter spell. Um, isn't the Howling Mind just the same thing then? But yeah. it's sorcery speed. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, use the Ghost Quarter. Yeah, we're gonna go to time if we keep fucking. He didn't take it. All right, tutelage. <laughs> Snap counter. He's got this logic knot. He's got two logic knots. Maybe we should have. Yeah, maybe we should have ran the Sphinx's two first, and then he could have done. One, two, he could have done one. He still could have countered it. We're not doing anything else. Man, Pass. We, we gotta land the staff and then. Seems like paths would be okay here too. No, the landing the staff and is still not gonna work with that Teferi around. Because he can tuck it. Yeah. Hit no, I can't do that one. Draw a card. Because it's minus three to talk, so he can't do it next turn. Well, he could do it next turn. Deals one damage to any target. Mm. I don't know. We might be, if we could resolve it. But we're going to take four. We might be casting, or we might be cracking the elixir this turn. Oh, we can't. It costs two, doesn't it? Is elixir one or two? Two. Damn. All right, so we're going to, we're not going to even Angel's Grace. This is bad, Josh. Oh, wait. Uh, no, I don't think we can Angel's Grace this. <laughs> let it go, let it go. Because that's three, puts us to eight. He's going to hit us for four. Yeah, we're okay. <laughs> we good, fam? We all right? We're not okay. We're not okay. You want an Angel's Grace here? No, it doesn't do anything. It doesn't? No. Oh, yeah, you're right. Damn you, Teferi. Pith and Needle, baby. Dawn Charm is decent. Draw again. Land, please. Thank you. Um, We're just going to play this untapped? I think so. Hold on. So we have, we have six lands, right? We need to be able to get the Dictate out, which is three. <laughs> Dawn Charm, which is five. And then we gotta be able to and then do that, and which is six. So, yeah, I think we play that untapped. And then when he tries to kill us, we basically Angel's Grace. Yep. Uh, pass turn? Yeah. Yeah. Let's see if he tries to do something in the upkeep. Or the end stuff. Oh, so burpy. Oh, so what? Moving, moving right to Oh, Josh! 
gosh. <laughs> I didn't hit any. What did you hit? Did you six or something? You sixed. Oh, did I? Yeah. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, okay. Oh, shit. Okay, we're better at this post-sideboard anyways. All right, so don't don't six anymore for the rest well, of the Well, don't, I won't. don't I won't. six when they have all that mana. Well, I won't six. Uh, fuck me. So, well, you're going to have to because you have like 10 minutes left. All right. So, I don't think we want the ley lines... Are you fucking kidding me? I don't think we want the ley lines. Snap, bolt, snap, bolt, snap, bolt, snap, bolt. I don't think we're... Okay, get, first of all, get the relics, okay? Do you want the Burning Forge Thunder because it it does your snap bolt bullshit? Uh, I just would rather play ley lines. All right, well, you have to also take the negates. Hold on. You got to make sure you got room for stuff. Trust me, we got room. I got this. <laughs> just... Just let me work my magicals. All right. All right, disenchants. No, we want the negates. <laughs> I'm just thinking out loud, bro. We, well, we got to get these things. All right. Uh, so, uh, Rash, let's take the staff out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not taking the staff out, you hear me? Uh, that was, that was, what, oh, you did it? Okay, I thought that would be your one thing that you were going to do. I'm taking the staff out. It was the one thing he wanted to play today. Oh, <sighs> uh, let's see here. Fuck Pollen Wallaby. Doesn't seem like we can clash well against them. Yep, so we've got Relics, Elixirs, so Holy three, Day. We got th we brought three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten cards in, so we took two out, so we um, need to take eight more out. Take out the Angel's Grace, this isn't the matchup for it. You're right. And I don't think we need the Holy Days, because we have the we have the Ethereal Haze, which is the same thing. We have the Angel Songs, which are better, and we have the Dawn Charms, which deal with some of his, his direct damage spells. So four, five, six. Um, we took six, seven, eight out. We need to take, take two a, more take out. Take a Verdict out? Maybe both? I think both. I mean, he's still going to come at us with those Snap snappies, dance. but like they're little guys. We have yeah. a lot of Fogs. We have a Recursion for Fog. I think, is he going to bring in any, like, uh, oh, we want to bring Disenchants in. Why? Because he's gonna bring in. Uh, he he plays. Uh, no, he doesn't. I was thinking blue white. Uh, uh, the three drop. Uh, o ring. That's white detention blue. sphere. Yeah. They're in the main. Do you think we should bring him in for detention sphere? Mm -mm. Okay. Is he gonna take our shit that causes him to draw a card? Who cares? Okay. Sounds good. Let's submit. All right. I won't f six anymore. I promise. Right. Just just sometimes. Oh, we want to play. Looks good. Yeah, looks good. Keep, baby, keep. Keep, keep. Island, relic, pass. Oh, you said you weren't going to six. <laughs> I sixed. Um... <sighs> This round is brought to you by sugar-free Red Bull. Hollow Fountain Taps, Pasco. Brought to you by sugar-free Red Bull. <laughs> oh, baby. They didn't crack here. So now you got to be playing with a relic. Um, Shelldot comes in tapped... We have two Sphinxes, too. Do they just say we try to play one now? I don't know. Mm. Or we can go for the long game and try to play one where we have a negate back up. Yeah, I want to land that thing. Okay, play the shot, Lego. Um, I think you want either the Dictate or the Temple Bell. Dictate. Dictate's okay. sweet. Yeah, you don't have to... Each player draws card. Yeah, that's fine. Um... Okay, so on your end step, he's going to crack his fetch, yes. and you're going to relic. And I, I would like to relic. He did not do it. Which means, usually means that he needs more land. Oh, baby. So, play the Glacier Fortress, play the Howling Mind, and then if you want to, you can use it again. You're right. I just cast Howling Mine in uh, Modern. 
This is, a lot, this is a lot of fun. Why? <laughs> For all you guys out there that are watching this, um, don't do this ever. Yeah. So, I think you actually want a relic right now. Because if he goes and gets... Target player, actually, yeah. So, if he goes and gets a blue source and then goes to Logic Not You, you can't pay. Because he'll have blue, blue... I know. To no, you can pay. You'd be able to pay, right? Doesn't matter. We just get rid of it because we're proper players. Because we're badasses. Oh, I didn't realize I had signed up for that club. <laughs> I'm fucking badass magic player, man. Badass. All right. So what do we want to do here? Nothing. We just want to fucking pass through your turn. Is this our turn? I have no idea. Just keep passing. None of this matters. Oh, this we is, played just keep going. Mine. Just keep going. Yep. We got nothing to do. Yeah, who, yeah. Ambush you got a, Viper. You got an Ambush Viper. Yeah, draw your card, baby boy. Take it. Take it like a good boy. Give me that damage. Yeah, I want to draw my extra card. Oh, another Howling Mine. Oh, baby. And play for quarters. Yeah, we're hitting our land drops. That's what I like to see. Yeah. Uh, use the shell dock. Just more, just more correct. Uh, more correct? Correctorer. Correct Correctorer. <laughs> <-er. laughs> correct. It's more correctorer. -er. You just represent more things. Oh yeah, yeah. Cryptic? You're, gonna, you're gonna cryptic this. I'm gonna negate the fuck. No, out no, of no, that. no, no, no. Oh. You're not. You're gonna play the Sphinx's tutelage. Oh, okay, we'll allow it. Yeah, I'm gonna negate the fuck out. <laughs> <laughs> you were just so excited to counter his spell. Yeah, I just All right, wanna... tutelage. That was really aggressive. So next turn he plays a Teferi, bounces the tutelage, I guess. Nice. Page at five. Yeah, we're tapping Next up. time that that Howling Mine shows up on our draw step, right click on it yeah, and tell it to yield yields. all the time. I think it's the top yield option. <laughs> All right, let's start milling. Let's put it doesn't matter which. Just click on one, and then always yield is fine. Always yield is fine. We hit two lands. Always yield. It'll trigger another tutelage. We hit another land oh, for him. I mean, all right, we're doing pretty good. Let's play this other tutelage. And then we got counter back up. This is actually a Dece, okay. I like being on the play. Be ready to crack this relic at a moment's notice. You got it. I like being on the play. Snappy. Nope. Is he trolling Snappy. us? Snappy. He's like, I got 17 minutes. I can just tap my lands and untap them just to fuck with them. I mean, I would do the same. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's he's not. Logic not for four. Um, negate. Just straight up negate. Oh, shit. Let's still have another one. Yeah, go for it. We should have cracked that first before we played it. Yeah. We're dumbasses. Keep going. Okay. He's got another one. Son of a bitch. We should have done it again, Josh. Called it. <laughs> well. All keep right. going. Yep, 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 yep. We can't pay for it. So click no. Fuck me. Fuck. <laughs> it's okay. We still have one online. He's used a bunch of logic knots. All right, pass turn. Six. On his own stuff, let's just crack the relic, I guess. Get a few things out of the way. Okay. Yeah, I mean, you're giving a control deck extra cards every turn. Yeah, it's tough. Yeah, Bob, attack us. We don't care. We're at 16. Don't. Well, Josh, stop hitting one. Okay, okay, <laughs> I am. Ooh, search, search for ass cancer. cancer. Yeah, we're, yeah, we're not okay with this, but this okay. This is a little bit troubling. Let's just... Do you want a relic, or do you want to try and control with relic? Because you control the the uh, search for Escanta. Uh, what do you want to do? Nah, let's crack it. Alright, crack it. I can get behind that. 
What is he doing? Is he gonna get, like, stifle us? Stifle bird. <laughs> He's not gonna stifle bird us, Josh. That'd be fucking sweet. Nibbles, whatever the nibble fuck that thing is called. Yeah. Flash and nibble obstructionist. The camera's autofocus, you gotta fix that. You drew, you drew a card, so you caused him to do shit. Hell yeah. All right. I thought I already yielded No, you. These. Well, you have to. They're triggering at the same time, so you have to choose the order that they go on the stack. It doesn't matter. All you have to do is click one each time. All right, slow down, slow down. Ooh, we drew a ley line. That's fucking banging ass draw. Oh, uh, he's got a bunch of cards in hand. We got this dictate. One, two, three, four. Then we can't cast the dictate, but we can cast the dawn charm and the ethereal haze. Um, he's at twenty nine, so we can almost shell dock aisle. I think. What do you want to do here? Does the ley line do anything? Yeah, it does. What does it do? Stops us from getting bolted to the fucking face a billion times. We're at fourteen. I'm playing the lane line. <laughs> All right, we'll use the shell dog off. <laughs> Rush does not like this play. No, he, he does not like this play. <laughs> no. Goodbye. Oh, he bounced the tutelage, which we cannot cast now, Josh. Whatever. We had this dictate and everything we could have done. It's fodder for drawing off of tutelage. We didn't get rid Dude, of this. Dude, no, we did. We have the Sphinx's tutelage, smart guy. We had it on the board. <laughs> so you refilled this graveyard super fast. Damn. So we should have cracked the relic in his. Uh... What does that trigger? Is in the draw stop? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We should have done it. The, the relic. This is why we should have ran at no, least no, no, all no, league no. with this deck. No, relax, relax. Because <laughs> we relax, have no we're idea. Fine. Did you? Uh, did, you didn't fog that turn either. <laughs> we got this. Oh God. Oh baby, we drew a colonnade. We're oh, good. Okay. We in there. Okay. We in there. We got so, blockers. So how do you get this tutelage to resolve again? Um, uh, we play a Howling Mine. He doesn't care. Howling Mine, three, yeah. You've shit. got, so... We're just we're If just anything, fucked. you play the Tutelage first, I guess, because if he has another Logic now, he's already showed us two. He doesn't have another one. Let's just play it out. What do you want to play? Let's play out the Sphinx's Tutelage. Who cares? Play the... Play the Howling Mine first. Think so? Yeah. All right. Because we'll, we'll try and haze him on his turn or something. Oh, he cares about the. He cares about. Oh, that. that's a weird card to have brought in against us. It's a really. I mean, I guess it counters. Does it counter all spell? Yeah, I guess it's okay. He must know what the hell's going on here. All right, make sure. I think you want to start fogging here. You're right. That is all the cryptics. So now he's got to start going snap cryptic. So a relic off the top is pretty good. Here goes the howling mine. Why would you bounce the howling howling mine guy? I don't know. He hates he hates cards. <laughs> he hates cards. He hates drawing extra cards. <laughs> this is a terrible matchup. It's a really bad matchup. Yeah, this is pretty bad. Like we were worried about Storm and Tron. We didn't even think about Jeskai or Blade. Um, now might, might have been a good time. What the fuck's he doing? To fairy. To fairy. He's got 15 minutes. He's just faking us out. He's, He's like, not whatever. faking us out. Bane Slayer. Oh. Uh, well, I think you still have to haze this turn. Really? Yeah, I think you need to start using your mana better. He's only got three cards left, so I guess. I don't know. Really needed the Sphinx's Tutelage. Bane Slayer Angel, what the hell? Dragons. Demons and Dragons. Ghost Quarter. Goodbye, search for Escanta. Don't do it yet. Don't do it yet. Don't give him cryptic mana. I think that was the fourth cryptic, but I don't care. 
Yeah, it was the fourth cryptid. It doesn't matter. It's dangerous. It's dangerous yeah. to go alone. <laughs> He's almost got 20 cards left in his library, so we're almost able to do that. Um, let's just Howling Mind and then... Yeah, Howling Mind and then goes core to the Search Rest Canton Pass. What? Good. Okay, go square. Pass it to turn. Six. Six. You can six at any time. We got double Dawn Charm up, baby. Mm. You gotta hope that one of them goes off. Oh, god damn it. Oh, shit. That's the second time we did that. <laughs> Doesn't matter. It's two damage versus all of this. Dawn Charm. Yeah, that's fine. Prevent all combat damage. <laughs> Let's just regenerate Bane Slayer Angel <laughs> and target it. All right, that resolved. On his end step, flash a Dictator Crufix. You got it. And then the Sheldock Isle is good next turn, too. So if we draw another Fog, it could be okay here. There's no way we're winning game three, though. <laughs> you don't say that. The gate. Ooh, fancy the gate. Yeah, that is kind of cool looking. Pass the turn. Okay. Okay. Good. Good. Um, play the six of lich. No, not with that one. Not with that one. Oh yeah. You going? Oh god. Doesn't matter. Oh, Doesn't snap. matter. Snapcaster. Oh. Snapcaster logic knot for a billion. Could be. Does he have knots left? Did we get all of them? Nah, there's only. These decks only play like two. Hit okay. X oh seven. my god, he's got another logic knot. <laughs> Just hit, X okay. Seven. hit okay and say no. And then hit no. Josh. <laughs> <laughs> Son of a bitch. Jamming out over here. You are jamming out. I got Priority, what's that? I got Tay-Tay in my ear. End of turn. Lightning Helix. Um, nope. No, no, let it go, let it go. Why? Because it's three damage. We're not dead. One is not dead. Either is seven. Let it go. You're right. Because if he counters the Angel Song this turn, we have to be able to Dawn Charm. How many cards does he have left in his deck? Nine, ten. He has no. Uh, eighteen. We're getting close. Angel song. Don't use the shell dock. <laughs> what if I cycled it on accident? So if he goes bolt snap bolt, we go to one. That's fine. Three. Yeah, I think we're still safe here. Okay, so this is okay. What if you cycled it? Yeah, that would have been fucking awful. <laughs> what if you did cycle it? Up? Okay, hold on, hold on. Hold on there, Snappy. And his end step, do this. Because I have no idea how this works. Just use the ability. Click on it. See if it'll let you do it. Yeah. Oh, just say no. I didn't know you had to pay it. Why are we playing Shell Dock Isle? This card's bad. It's like a weird cantrip. It doesn't really give you the card. Glacier Fortress. Uh, pass to turn. Yeah. If he goes to, like, shoot you, let it go. Okay. You need the Dawn Charm for a Bolt Snap Bolt. Uh, that's fine. Gotta get real careful here now. Yeah, I won't F6 through our death like I did last game. <laughs> Haze. This, this Dawn Charm is just gonna get spell snared anyway. It's gonna be great. <laughs> okay. Now, in his end step, this time, try and chill lock on him. Okay. Bad card. Huh? 
How does he have 13 minutes left? <laughs> I don't want to explain it to you, that Josh. That is insane. I don't want to explain it I to you. I wish we had 13 minutes left. God damn. Put target non-land permanent into its owner's no, third from the top. Yep. We can't even do that. We can't even stop it. It doesn't matter. I know. It Slow matter. down. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, shell lock. Hey, oh, Josh. Yeah. Okay, just, just, just go. I'll tell you later. Oh, okay. <laughs> God damn it, Josh. Oh, you don't hit no. You, you just don't hit. Card. Yeah, you're so used to saying say no for okay. the other thing. Okay, play That's that okay. and crack it, I guess. Yeah, he's F6 and crack this thing. One more mana. Alright, pass turn. I got it. You're like, activate this? Would you like to cast it? No! Why, why, why are you bothering? No, go away! Do you see I only have two minutes on the clock? Quit trying to give me priority, damn it! Quit trying to make me play magic. Oh, God. Oh, shit. We're just gonna die right here because this is gonna get countered. It's gonna be fucking hilarious. I should have just fucking targeted well, and generated. We're, well, we have a draw here. Can't even chill, Doc Isle. <laughs> we literally have nothing. This turn you can actually have six. Come on, bolt snap bolt, baby. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Here it comes. Snapcaster, target lightning bolt. Okay. Go to one. Yeah, we at one. Why is he giving us the turn back? Oh, maybe he needs the mana? No, he doesn't need the mana. Kill us! Ooh, a shell knock aisle! <laughs> that's, that's what we get. Go ahead, put it. I want to see what we get. Fuck, it's hey, we have a minute and 23 seconds card. to fucking... Okay. We have a minute and 23 seconds to win two games. Uh, okay, that sucked. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Pick something. Don't try. Okay, pass the turn. I feel bad for this guy that's, that's wasted an hour of his life with us. That's okay. <laughs> that's okay. 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 Uh, Do you want hit, to take the control? No, hit return. To, no, I don't. To return to details. Okay. But let me see the deck. Go to the other uh, window there. Which, uh, which you gotta go here. Yeah. And then go here. And now go to collection. And then show me Shell Dock Isle. Uh, da, da, da. You may play the exile card without paying its mana cost if a library has 20 or fewer cards in it. Well, why couldn't we play it? He must not have had 20 or fewer cards. No, he totally did. Huh. Why wasn't it giving us the option? Do we have to click on the actual card, too? Is Moto just a pain in when the it ass? it does, look at the top four cards of your library, exile it face down. Yeah, it doesn't matter what it is. It doesn't say it has to be a certain type of card to play it. Huh. This should get around the timing restriction. And even if it didn't, the, the enchantments that, that we had had uh, a flash. All right, well... Let's get into the next match. Maybe we have to click on the spell. Whatever. We'll get it next time. Ready to get in the next match? Yeah. Okay. Let's get it. Oh, I didn't hit record. <laughs> For what? For all of this. So we'll just download it as one big file again. That's okay. That's okay. Is today the last chance for people to get in on the uh, the raffle thing? Or... Yeah, it is. Okay. Should I get the pack out? Uh, we can just talk about it, and I'll just put my hand in front of your face for tradition. <laughs> no! So everyone pre prevent uh, pretend that I have a pack of revised here, and I'm holding it in front of Josh's face. Ah! Don't lick the pack. Uh, sh that's Mulligan. Hey, do the pack thing. I got this. So, for those of you that don't know, we are giving away a pack of Revised. And in order to be part of the giveaway, all you have to do is go to our YouTube channel, which is Mom's Basement Games at YouTube. And um, you have to be subscribed to the channel. You have to find any of our Magic Afternoon, um, what are they called, Competitive League video series. Mm -hmm. And leave a comment in the, section, in the comment sections below of any of them. Uh, you do those two things, you're entered into the raffle tonight during Magic After, after Dark, which is at about 1 a.m., 1.30 a.m. Uh, too bad we don't have mana. Um, Focus. Sorry. Um, 
What did I say already? <laughs> if you've done those two things, if you've subscribed to the channel and you've left a comment on one of the video series, you're in the raffle, then we're going to select somebody. <laughs> <laughs> we just won the match, baby. He inquisitioned and fucking scooped. The entire match? Yeah. Yeah, we just won. Give me a high five. <laughs> what the fuck? Listen, if you want to play a deck and you just want people to scoop <laughs> to you, uh, play, <laughs> play Blue White Sphinx's Tutelage. What the fuck? Dude, he's, he can't beat this deck. He's playing Jun. <laughs> he went, we could draw or be like us and, and play poorly. Yeah, but he just thought like, oh, these guys are probably good. No, <laughs> no, or yeah. no. Anyways. That was sweet. Revise back. Giveaway. YouTube channel. Mom's Basement Games on YouTube. Mm -hmm. Subscribe. Leave a comment in any of our Magic Afternoon series videos. Yep. Um, and then you're entered. We're going to give away the pack tonight. Uh, it's tonight, right? Yeah, it's tonight it's at tonight. Well... And we're gonna we're gonna um we're gonna give away probably like it'll it's probably, gonna be sometime during the show yeah it'll be during it's gonna the be show. sometime during the show for magic after dark um and then on top of that like for your comment like you don't have to leave anything particular but we would love to see or hear decks that you enjoy so you tell us one of your favorite decks that's awesome or if you tell us a deck that you'd like to see us play on magic afternoon that's even more awesome yeah now um if you don't want to watch us play blue white sphinx's tutelage fuck then um you know leave a comment and say hey don't play that deck ever again ever again you just but make jun players listen, bad yeah. <laughs> what the we, just, fuck? we just got scooped too he he i okayed and scooped that was That's fucking so sweet. weird we get to see everybody's in this right if you if you can you here click on player i want to see if it like sorts it differently it does okay now scroll down till you get to the case i want to see his record going into that so it's kzr so he's there that was his first no, it says undefeated trophies. It doesn't tell you their, uh... Hmm. Interesting. I thought it was going to show their records. <laughs> I love that he just scooped. It he was just the best. Scooped. He's like, this isn't worth my time. Yeah, so uh, the other thing I wanted to talk about with uh, with our giveaway is that there's only 71 people as of this afternoon. That's pretty good, but that it's not crazy. It. No, that can win it. But, because oh. nobody else can win it. If you're not, if you're not subscribed to our you YouTube be, channel, like, you can That's win. the minimum, is you have to be subscribed, so that's yeah. our base number. And... One of those people is my is my lovely wife. Oh, Julia? Julie. Julie, sorry. You can call her Julia, that's great. I don't want to call her Julia, even though I probably will from now on accidentally. <laughs> yeah, you'll continue great. to correct me that it's Julie. Yeah, but, you know, of course she, you know, she doesn't watch any of the videos, but... Jules? You know, yeah. Jules. Jules McGulls? <laughs> Jules Verd? Jules Verd. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to try to think of, come up with other names for other their names wife now that are close to Julie. <laughs> Julia Bulia? Luce? Lucy? Do <laughs> Lucy? Do Lucy. Lucy Goosey. Dude, that was freaking weird. I wanted to say if we had mana and a dawn charm, somebody goes to the thought or IO Chaos, we can counter that if we want to. Because it targets us. Fuck yeah, we can. I just hit join match. Oh. You're, you're, wait <laughs> you're waiting for the opponent to join. Why ain't it working? Huh. How do I enter this. this ish? In order to enter for the revised pack giveaway, again, you need to go to our YouTube page, which is Mom's Basement Games on YouTube. You have to be subscribed to the channel, and you have to leave a comment in any of the comment sections for any of our Magic Afternoon series, um, including this one, which I think I can get up right away, as long as this doesn't go too long. And then uh, we're going to take all the people that have done those things, we're going to put them in a random thing, we're going to let the random thing select somebody, random and then we're going to announce that. Random generator. Ooh, so this is the new Hardscales. Affinity Hearn Scales? This is the Ballard deck. Josh Ballard plays this. Um, yeah, Colin Eagle. Oh. This could be a great deck if we just have, or a great matchup for all of our uh, fog effects. Oh, I can't wait to cast Staffin in if we get there, we don't die. Uh, it's probably not going to do anything at that point, everything's going to be too big. Sixth. I know, but when you go, it, it won't skip through your blockers. Um, do we have a two? Do we have something we want to play on two? No. No? Play the Glacial Fortress and go. Because we got Ethereal Haze. We can Ethereal through the next turn. Dink. Dink, 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 dink. God, this is a pretty good um, matchup. Unless I, we do, get our do we want to do it next turn? No. Okay. So we can get our face shot off, right? There's the Hardened Scales. I'm cool with that. Um, what? With like a walking blister? 
yeah, like that thing right there. Um, I don't think we can beat that. No? Yeah. I'm trying to think. Yeah, no, you don't. don't what, do you want to take this damage? Take the damage. It's two points of damage. You don't start fogging until it gets tight, but that walking glass is going to Do we need to get rid of this white source? Why? What's it? Do? What does it do for them? I don't know. I'm just asking if we need. To I don't know this deck well enough. This is a new deck. Okay. So. Um. This see. you have to do. Um. What is it called? Exclamation point deck list, and it'll come up for you, buddy. Uh, tutelage go. Yeah. We want to tap out here. Why not? All right. You got to get this thing on the board. I think you want this over the tumble bell because you could just play the tumble bell and activate it and then have the tutelage already there. Yeah. Now we just want to draw as many fogs as possible and some way to deal with this walking blissa, which again, I have no idea because we don't have a um, pithy needle. Mm. I don't know how to deal with this thing. Even post side. Oh, we have ley lines. That's gonna be an awful card to have to put in, but we have to put it in, I think. Wow. I feel like we're about to get shot to the face here. Oh, because he put it all on the walking ball stone? Yeah. Doesn't seem worth it yet. Wow, what the fuck? Okay. Nine, ten, yeah, okay. Oh, yeah, oh god, you're right, now we die. Yeah, that's why I was like, we don't tap out here. Well, you gotta explain yourself, you can't just be like... Okay. Do this, you don't, don't do have that. To yell at me. I'm gonna yell at you, no. I don't, I, like, I don't know how to not die here anyways. The Angel Grace is the only way. Yeah, the Angel's Grace would've, would've stopped it. We had our, we had Wow. Our... That, that was cool. Yeah, it's cool, like, it's just like, what was that, a t that was turn three? Turn three. Yeah. It's good. All right, so so you know you know what this deck does, right? Yeah, I do. I don't know what this. Deck I do. Deck well, does. it's just like it's just combo. Shoot your fucking face off. It's pretty much storm. All right. Does it's that mean the we same want exact the wrath thing then? as storm? No, we don't care. Wrath's too slow. Wrath's too slow. Yeah. Um. Don't need any of the rest of that stuff. No. So you're gonna cut your verdicts then? Um. No, because we want to keep some in some number in. All right. Well, then take out. Uh, Take out your staff. Nope. Really? Not you just got to tell out. me Rath's too slow? Not You're taking the staff and in out. Okay. I'm going to kill him with it. All right. Breathe. Breathe in. I'm hiccuping. Let's get Let's get rid of Temple Bells. Yeah, I guess they just seem slow. We have to have the elixir because we have to just be able to continue to see fog, right? Yeah. Howling Mines. I'm uh, going to cut four things here. Yeah. Excellent well. list for my girlfriend to play. The field was with uh no i immediately yeah. recommend some some edits to this list including <laughs> the mana base i have no idea what they should be but the mana base all right so I you took out good. fogs and you're keeping in staff and and wraths which you said were too slow no i think we got enough fogs in what okay i think i have no idea pithy needles are needed thank you i love pithy needle I don't know, buddy. This is this is on you because I don't know how well this. I don't know exactly what this deck does. I know that it's affinity that has hardened scales, and I know Ballard would play it a lot, but I don't think that he would play it to the point that he had like a ton of successions with it. Who changed that layout? That is a weird. Would you like to play first? Yeah. God damn. That'd right, be, that'd be good. Oh baby, that's a keep. There's got no fogs though. I know. Fuck. That's not a keep. That's not a keep. Get that the fuck out of here. Oh, it's got a ley line too? Oh, baby. All we gotta do is draw one land. Let's keep it. Let's keep it in scry. I already have everything missing. The verdict's easy one trade for me. Um, bottom. Bottom, bye bye. Yes. Click. No, no, don't you dare click that. You click the ley line. <laughs> Thank you. Now click OK. <laughs> I've never put a ley line in the I play. know, I know. Thank Especially you. not a moto. Uh, uh, wait, 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 wait. Hollow Farm. Tappy tap. 
and double sixes. Sex. Oh, sex. It's definitely a cool, fun-looking deck, but it seems super awkward against a lot of different things. Like, if your meta can support this, then go for it. But, like, if you have such a wide variety in your meta, I don't think that you want to be playing something like this because it just seems like it's well, it's too high it's variance. Not, I, don't think, I don't think it's narrow. I, I mean, I think this deck's real. I think it's real that it can be better. I think it can be better. Hey, oh, slow, like, baby, oh, we did it. You slow piece of crap We land. did it, boys. Should just be a fetch, you stupid fucking land. Let's win more. Um, land? No, we want holy, holy day. day. You, yeah, you don't want the land. You want the holy day. Yeah. Any order. Yeah, I'm getting it. Or maybe working on it, Chris. Uh, yeah, pester, pester. Or maybe uh, maybe you want the uh, what's the what was the other one? It wasn't the dawn charm, was it? It whatever. Yeah, it was another dawn charm. Maybe we want the dawn charm just because it's two mana versus one mana. We keep the one mana in our deck, but we don't have any shuffle effects. We have one. I'm sorry. We have the elixir. We're about to get hanger back walker to the face. Maybe. Did you play another one? Is that another one? That's another one. Well, on a six through your turn, So now bad. he's got some mana. He can play a card that's going to get banned. It's not going to get banned. Card's not getting banned. It's not getting banned. Everybody quit crying about Ancient Stirrings. It's not getting banned. Who's everybody? Uh, like, going into the BNR this round, everybody was like, Oh, Ancient Stirring needs to go against KCI and Affinity and Tron and all this other fucking... It's like, guys, it's not going anywhere. It's fine. So, we just want to play out Sphinx's tutelage here, Oh, right? someone told me we didn't want to tap out last time. <laughs> <laughs> You're a piece of shit. Oh, yeah. Now we can, because we can't get yeah. shot to death. Oh, That's... is that why that is? Oh, okay. yeah. You're making excuses. Yeah, I see how Sorry, I know how to fucking play magic, <laughs> asshole. I'm this, like, I think we're going to die here. This I shouldn't is, tap out. This is also a really bad matchup here, because our Sphinx's tutelage basically can't hit more than, like, maybe four cards at a time. That's okay. Maybe one day down the line we play um, the blue black mill with Hedron Crabs and uh, Glimpse of the Unthinkable and stuff like that. Mill? Yeah, true mill. Oh, yeah. We'll play mill for sure. We'll There's so many. When, about we, it when everybody saw that we were playing pants. Sphinx's Tutelage, everybody's was like, oh, play, play mill. I kept seeing a bunch of responses like, play uh -huh. mill. And I'm just like, I'll play mill. Mill's actually really good. Yeah, it's really it's it's good. way more consistent because it just it finally got the pieces that it needed. Yeah, it's like this deck with not Down Syndrome. I don't really like the Hedron Crab. I think is what it's called. He's good, but I, I I've seen him be good. He's but legit. like I don't I just don't like him. It's like a lot of things in Magic. If I don't like the art, I don't want to play it. Yeah, that's that's great. That's is like, it? That's like listen to the Spice Girls because they're hot. <laughs> that makes sense. That makes, that makes a so lot of much sense. sense. Ah, uh, so I'm going to tell you what I want. What I really, really what want? You, what I really, really want. <laughs> You're a piece of shit. Oh, that's a big hanger back walker, y'all. Yeah, that's a big hit. Whew, we almost died. <laughs> we take it. Holy oh, shit. This deck is nuts with a, a, a hard scales. Just wait, wait, wait. Um, yeah. Yield. Yield. Always yield. We're going to win this game. We got a lot of fogs. We need another land. We're going to win the fuck out of this game. So I think we can play the Howling Mind and just a holy day because he can't shoot us right why can't you be good because we're really bad and then also there's moto why'd you do that because i'm just gonna move to second main it doesn't change anything shut your mouth it doesn't change anything <laughs> don't tell me what to do okay i'm gonna tell you what i want though <laughs> <laughs> tell me what you really really want uh i wanna i want a pass turn pass turn pass turn because, like, he can't get us this time, right? No. He can't shoot us. He's not going to be able to, like, hit us with no. anything. Here's a card. Go ahead. Draw the card. He's locked out of this game. Oh, uh, locked out of the game? He's playing green. He could blow up the late one, right? All right. Don't mess this up. <laughs> Shut your mouth. <laughs> Shut your mouth. You're talking to me. I hope he scoops right here. I hope he just rage scoops right here. 
when he sees like Holy the John Day. guy. Yeah, like that the John guy. That guy saved us so much time. I really appreciate that guy. Yeah, that guy's great. Okay, here we go. We just gotta fog every turn for the rest of the game. Uh, doesn't matter which, and then we gotta yield to the Howling Mind. Always yield. Always yield. Okay, so he's at 40. We have a Ghost Quarter, which is good. We have a lot of stuff here. Um, yeah, we do. Just pass the just turn. Just pass the turn. I want Josh to play a real deck. We play a real deck every other week. Yeah, you know what deck we're playing next week? I don't know. Oh, we're playing Bumpy Burn next week, right? We're playing a real Black Lightning. We're gonna fucking five zero. We're gonna play in Jun Jun. My list of Jun Burn next week. We're you're, gonna fucking smash. You're gonna have to find some time to do a little bit of practice so that I, you're ready. No, 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 no. <laughs> so I mean, you would have had one more step, but you're okay. Uh, white. Don't use the the Ghost Quarter. Blue. Yeah. Uh, do you want a pollen here? That's pollen. That's pollen. That's fun. I don't know what the fuck this is. Well, does. Clash. Yeah. Just do it. I don't... Like, if we go to Ghost Quarter, this Horizon Canopy, while it's untapped, he's just going to draw a card and basically negate our, our Ghost Quarter. Oh, I think we won the Clash. What did he reveal? Did it say? I don't think so. For each card, put it on top of his... Okay. Uh, click it. Can we... Let's put that on the bottom. Yeah, fuck that card. It's sweet. I mean, if he blows it up, we'd like to have a second copy, but... Uh, click this little eyeball thing right here. Hold on. Tangram declares attack or stop, cast instance or act. Yeah. No, we don't care about that. We already did that. Okay, so okay. No, I want to I wanna see what he revealed what the with the eyeball. The, th the one that looks like an eye, Josh. This one? No, Josh. The one that looks like oh, an eye. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, so he revealed... Arc bomb? Citadel. Might have been the Citadel. Okay, hit X on both of those and then get our turn back. You got it. All right, so we already fogged, right? Yes, okay. that's what the the pollen is, right? Thank God. Declare blocker step. Yeah, hit okay and then read the pollen one more time. The pollen's a fog, right? Yeah, of course it is. Okay, well then, yeah, we did it then. X X. Yeah, I don't I don't think we want to ghost quarter. We could ghost quarter the the razor verge thing if we really wanted to. Oh, now he's got two cards and canopies. What you gonna do, guy? You got a walking ballista. Thanks. Now it might be... Hold on. It might be worth ghost courting here, Josh, because you can only crack to activate one of them. Yeah, but then we lose double. If we don't draw a land, we lose double what's-its-face. Why do we need double fog at this point? Is he going to counter us? <laughs> I mean, I don't know what the ghost... I don't think the ghost quarter matters there anyways. Could. I think that the Ghost Quarter's in for, like, Tron or something to, like, slow them down. Uh, it, it's it's going to thin his deck out. It takes puts one more card in his... And it takes one more card out of his deck. It does take one more card out of his deck. That's 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 a good point, because he's yeah. got to decide if he wants to draw here. Yeah. Or if he just wants to go get a land. Ooh, the game of thinker. Mm-hmm. He's stinking. You know what he's probably thinking about? He's probably like, ooh, they're going to... If I go and search, they're going to mind trap... Mind break trap the fuck... Or no... He's probably thinking, man, how am I going to cast my acidic 13. slime without land? <gasps> I fucking called it. <laughs> I fucking called it. You called it. Yeah, I said he's got green. Um, Yeah, that doesn't target us. We're in some deep shit here, buddy. Yeah, we are. We're dead, we right? The other one. No, wait. <gasps> no, we have Angel's Grace. Have Angel's Grace. Oh, man, why did we tuck the other way? Okay, line? okay. Uh, that one's okay. Yeah, we should have tucked the other way line. You're right. Oh, God. It's fine. It's fine. Just wait. Just wait. Hit okay. I'm so scared. Chris, hold me. I don't want to. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. We have to do... We have to Angel's Grace when he goes to sack the Arcbound and put everything on the walking ballista. Yes. Which even that is only going to give us a turn, I think. No, we have to do it. We have to do it when we're at one. Don't no, we? we can't, because then he just does it in response. Oh, it has split second. Yeah, it's we have to do second. it when we go to one. Okay. All right. Start. We need to speed through this a little bit. Okay. Go ahead. But then he could just shoot us in the upkeep. He's right. So are we just dead here? 
Maybe we Aegis Graze now and just see if he kills us in our upkeep because he has so many counters on this thing? No, let's just fuck. Let's just keep. Uh, let's just see if he's gonna. All right. I'm gonna go get a drink. I'll be right back. I won't be gone long, I promise. <laughs> oh, God, you're scaring me. <laughs> it's gonna be fine. fine. Already right, starting to shoot us. He already started shooting you? Yeah. All right, keep going. Let him, let him shoot at you. I'm pretty sure that's my pet. Man, he really doesn't want to let this ghost quarter go. We're at 10. Okay. Yeah, he doesn't have nine. Oh, he doesn't have the arc bound anymore. He didn't sack the other thopters. We're at eight. What was the point of not sacking the other thopters? We're at seven. I don't know if you can do this. Josh. We're at six. Yeah, keep going. We just wait till we're at one. I, it doesn't matter because again, in our upkeep, he just shoots us. Yeah. Keep going though. This sucks balls. Maybe do it here? Like it doesn't really matter. Yeah, he's right. We're just gonna Maybe but maybe he'll maybe he'll keep clicking or something. We so fucking dead, dog. Yeah. Oh, he did it again. Yeah, he's just putting us to one. Or maybe he's putting us to negative. There's no difference. No, he can't put us to negative. Okay, so he put gonna, us to one. So, so here gonna, comes the upkeep. Yeah, so he's going to pass turn, and then he's going to attempt to shoot us. Mm-hmm. Right here. Yep. Uh, walk, It does one damage to any target, so mm -hmm. he's targeting us. Yep. So, so we can this is, charm no, and no, we're going to No, no, counter-target spell that targets you. Uh, yeah, all right, we did. What's under the shell dog? Nothing. Fuck. Fuck. That's too bad. I would have loved to see a game three against them because that was uh, that was an interesting deck. Yeah. That's that's the new take on affinity, right? Mm, yeah, it's like a sideways affinity deck. It's 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 weird. I mean, like it's cool. Like he's playing a competitive league. He paid twelve bucks to to play with that awful weirdness and. That seemed really good. <laughs> that seemed really good. I mean, he just had every piece that he needed. So it's got... The, the key piece is hardened scales, right? You don't get that, the deck's not as powerful. Yeah. So we probably needed to draw Disenchant there. Did we even put Disenchant in? Yeah, I brought him in. Okay. Because, like, they're, the whole deck is artifact base. Yeah. So even if we had put that other uh, ley line on top, we still would have died. Yeah. Because we, we, we didn't get to draw it. You know, God, I wonder if there's a the nature if there's a brutal. I wonder if there's a spell. I think there's a oh, there's a spell that uh, counters uh, when something targets a permanent that you have. It's blue white. It's like hinder. Oh, uh, there's a there's a just blue one now as well. Oh, it's just a one drop. I think it's just a one drop. Nah, that's cool. I think I talked about <clears throat> no, I played. I was talking about playing the green one um, when we were playing uh, the Kentucky special, the mono okay. green snobby stuff. Uh, it's like a void fade or something like that. It's the green one. I don't remember the blue one, though. Into the next one. All right. So we are one, one two. and two. And the one, uh, it totally, they just, they it just counts. Scooped. Yeah, it counts. I'm totally counting that as a win. Because the guy I okayed and scooped. It was beautiful. Because he knew he couldn't beat it. Or he just didn't want to spend an hour of his life playing against two, uh, he probably... two professional magic players. <laughs> Listen, we're going to be on the pro tour someday. Like, as commentators, or... Yes. Okay. <laughs> we just gotta work our craft right now. Uh, so, in years from now, we're just gonna be like... Fix our That's fine. There's, a uh, When we were at we're Nationals... We're saying, like, swear words, though. No, we? I, we, that, we can't do it. We can't do it. Then they're never gonna hire yeah. us. We won the die roll. Fuck yeah. I can't remember his name. I think it's, like, RJ Westfall or something like that. He's a... He's a streamer, and I've seen his stuff, and I really like his layout and everything like that. He did coverage for Nationals uh, while we were there, and um, I f he usually works alone. I feel like working with another person really threw him off. Hall of Fountain Tap, who cares? No. Yeah, Let's Hall of Fountain Tap. One. Why? Because it matters. It don't matter. <laughs> it fucking matters. That was Trust me. Huge. Cool. 
That Arby's, man. You also took two? This, this round of uh, Magic Afternoon is brought to you by Arby's. Please, Arby's. In I my stomach. I love many of your sandwiches. And your... Uh, what's it's, that chicken... Chicken salad, whatever I really like. Pecan chicken salad. Uh, I don't know. I don't know either. Bastard. Let's save Man, us some time. Let's we could have some time. We could have been playing the elixir on this turn and be at twenty life. But that two points is gonna matter. That two points is gonna be the difference. Call me out, bitch. Lightning bolt. Nope, that's opt. Called it. Don't just say words and then say called it. Called it. <laughs> oh god. Uh, oh, it's a guru line. Oh god, we're I so dead. Oh. We're so dead. He's playing gurus online. We're fucking fucked. I think gurus online are like a buck. Oh, are they? <laughs> They're not like your gurus. Okay. They're not like Josh has Josh has both of his basics in his in his burn deck now. They're not three hundred in real life. Are you you don't have a swamp, right? It's just two mountains? Yeah, it's just two mountains. It's both of his mountains now are our gurus. They're very nice. They're they're gorgeous. I bought them this I bought one this past weekend. Here comes the logic knot yeah, again. Yeah, you logic knot that oh, shit. Oh, logic knot is so annoying. Dumb card is dumb. No, we don't want to pay. Don't care. Draw that shit out. Watch out for Blood Moon. I'd love to get Blood Moon. Blood that, Moon me. That would be so yeah. bad. With our ghost quarter tap, so yeah, we can't search for our island. Real bad. I don't even know if we search for our There's a better here. chance of lions going to Cyborg before Josh becomes a pro. <laughs> I'm going to Super Bowl. I'm going to sideboard. It's <laughs> <laughs> going to sideboard. Going to pass the turn. <laughs> Josh is never going to go to sideboard. Oh shit! <clears throat> the Lions will go to the fucking. No, Super Bowl they someday. will not. Why did you start this? Who said that? Icy fire. Icy fire. Don't get him going, okay? The and Lions are a garbage team with Lions a garbage are, quarterback. They are yes, not. he's garbage. Moving on. Okay. Let's get rid of this red source. No. Let's play a Sphinx of Scoolage. Right now? Why not? We don't have negates. You're right. But let's keep up, yeah, one of the ghost quarters so that we can ghost quarter one of my lands in case of a blood moon. Because he right. could just be playing... It could Like, the steam events might be a throw-off. It could just be, like, blue moon with uh, the red only to do, like, the blood moon. On sub for that, Chris. That's fine. Stafford has a cannon... And no aim. He has great receivers. Uh -oh. Lightning bolt to the face. Take it. Take it. Lions are a great team. You, I'm you not talking about this. this anymore. You started this. I'm not talking about it anymore. Lions no. are going to go... Uh, Stop talking 15, about it. 15 and 0 this year. If the O came first, yeah. <laughs> oh, and 15. No, they won't go 0 and 15. They're not that bad. Oh, he thunk twice. <laughs> I wasn't ready for that, Josh. He just thumped twice. <laughs> I was not ready. Uh, always yield. Oh, yeah, I should always yield. Can I do it on this? No. Fuck, stupid fucking game. Uh, Josh, would you like to play your land for turn? Oh, yeah. You need to go to a main phase there, Josh. You're right. You're not wrong. I was thinking about the Lions winning this year. Not? Nah, well, yeah. I'm just... Shut up! Just okay. Shut up. Uh, yeah, we don't care. We don't want to pay the two life. Oh, do we not? All right, pass we want to cycle that angel song though. Yeah, we do. At the end of turn, that's for fucking shout. Cycle the, the angel song. Oh, here we like, go. So this? he's gonna do something in his end step, and I'm gonna ghost quarter both of his fucking. Man, men. I just want there to be more interaction. No, don't ghost quarter. Why? Because he gets the lands untapped. Oh, you're right. Do you want to cast two things on this turn? I'm gonna do it during his upkeep. You're gonna ghost quarter both his lands, and and what if we do get blood moon? Yeah, also, you didn't have the upkeep set again. <laughs> <laughs> the yielding during the upkeep? Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna do it now. You could, if you really want to. I really want to. I don't, I don't, th I don't think these ghost quarters are in for completely different matches. I don't think that they're for any of this, so it doesn't matter. But, like, we go down land then. You draw your staff in him, you can't play it. Alright, can I stop this? Yeah, you just hit cancel. How? Oh. I'll oh, cancel. Alright, you're right. Staff and him. Always yield, always yield. Yes. Time savers, baby. Shell Heil. Also, we should have cycled that angel song. Fuck. 
we're over here talking about how awesome the Lions Stop are. Stop talking about them. <laughs> Click OK. <laughs> I'm losing my shit. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, we want the, the tutelage. That same old love. All right, Professor. Uh, six. No, I don't want six, do I? No, uh, well, we don't have any Dawn Charms, so I don't know. It doesn't really matter. He's just got all of his straight damage. Man, we could be at 12 right now. <laughs> you piece of shit. <laughs> Maybe you could cycle for some talent. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Is that what the Lions are trying to do when they move shit around? Will they keep that quarterback? Uh, Ascanta and Colonnade will be your targets later, probably. Ascanta and Colonnade are good calls. Hey, we drew a card and we, we milled him. Pretty cool. He's just going to have a giant logic knot. The biggest logic knot. Oh, uh, don't don't play lands. that. Don't play that. Play the holophone. Why am I playing the holophone? Tapped? Yeah. So that we don't take more damage. You're right. Uh, he has 35 cards in his, so we need another 15 out before we can cast this other Sphinx's Tutelage. At some point, he's going to cryptic bounce the Tutelage, though, right? Mm -hmm. We need to be looting with this thing, too. Cost six. Well, now we can do it. Snapcaster, do we care about that? Um, Is there a cryptic? Let's see what he's going to target. There's a cryptic. Scroll back up. Go back in there and just scroll. Or use your mouse wheel. See, there's a cryptic there. Okay, let, let, let the Snapcaster enter. Let's see what he targets. Well, he's just going to uh, do... Oh, lightning we helix. don't have a relic. I thought we had a relic. No, he's going to do Lightning Helix. Yeah, see? Lightning Helix. Yeah. Okay, we good with that. I don't know about being good with it. Should we just crack off our Elixir of Immortality? No. Because we want to draw a card with the Snakes of Tutelage, right? Uh, that's what the Brownies are trying to do. Tutelage second ability. You sure? We're going to die. You sure you don't want to crack this off? Gain some life? Well, why can't we do it on his turn? Because we might die in response to him double bolting us. We're going to go to what? We're going to go to seven? And then we're going to holy day? Yeah, you're right. I mean, it's close. It's definitely close. Should have got rid of both of those red sources. He just has... He, he's got to have a basic red source. I don't know, man. Well, before we die, you can look. You can go score to see what he gets. Okay. He might just... I don't know. He might... So now we have we only have five. We're definitely gonna elixir this turn. Yeah. Okay, there you go. Yeah, bitch. Pop it's going. It's going. It's gonna, it's gonna let it resolve. Okay. We've negated one and a half of his spells. Get a holy day. Play a planes. Do you just want to draw with the tutelage and see what we get here? Draw a card, discard a card. So How many three, lands are we going to have? Six. We'll have two lands open. I might get a dawn charm. I want to ghost quarter his fucking red sources right now. Why would you do it right now? Because again, he's he floats the mana. You do it in his upkeep. No, I do it in our first main. You do it in your first main? Yeah. Why? And then move to combat. He's going to float the mana and, and he'll just use it. We're not looking to resolve anything here. I don't care. I'm ghost quartering. Okay. I'm tired of you telling me now. Okay. You're about to run out of enough lands to use your Sphinx's tutelage. Don't care. Okay. <laughs> don't fucking care. Oh, here we go. Here comes the bolt. Bolt me. Just fucking bolt me. So move into your... You're beginning a combat before you do your second ghost quarter. You're right. He didn't get a land. You're goddamn right he didn't. Alright, ghost quarter again. He's, so he's got three basics? Here told comes you. the snapcaster. I told you.
There it is. What the hell? What the hell, damn guy? Okay. Next step. Cryptic bounce. Cryptic yeah. bounce would be brutal. This is snap helix again? Or electrolyze? He can't electrolyze, he doesn't have any blue. Bolt? Okay. Nothing we can do about that. Unless you want to try for a, doll, a darn eh, dawn charm, but you can't cast it, so we're not doing anything. Pass turn. I'm on it. I am on it. Can we cycle for more player, like a better player? We cycle out of this? <coughs> Let me ask Matt Stafford. <laughs> Jesus Christ. God, this guy's just got it, got it all. Oh, baby. We're just getting their fucking face ripped off. I don't like getting destroyed by Josh Thompson. <laughs> You're not the only girl. <laughs> <laughs> oh, holy day. Holy, oh, holy night. day. <laughs> um, here, click this little thing right here, Josh. This little eye for the chat. We'll add that to the stream layout for future generations. Now we can. You have priority, my dude. Oh. I'm trying to hit one. You're not in the window. You click over here, remember? Oh, shit. Fucking loot with this thing. Yep. But uh, somebody used their ghost quarters. <laughs> All right. Play the hell, man. Yeah, Kesha, get him. On the flight till we see the sunlight. Okay, lyrics. <laughs> what am I not allowed to I say? I didn't know there were lyrics. I didn't know the lyrics. I just, I just know the beat. Well, and I like, I like Kesha cool. too. Well, I'm going to see Kesha in two months. That's fucking with cool. With my sister in law, yeah. That's she's super got, cool. She got tickets for her birthday, and I'm going to go. So I'm going to dress up in. Uh... Kesha is a cool, powerful, positive chick, man. Listen to my outfit. I'm going to get some angel wings. You're out? Oh! I'm going to get a Speedo, <laughs> then I'm going to cover myself in glitter. You know some dudes, just, some random dudes is going to lick you, right? Just I'm going to, I'll just, I'll try to forget about it. Just dudes just going to walk up and be yeah. like, hey, angel boy, and then fucking lick you right across just gonna the try, face. I'm just going to try to forget about it. I'm going to pay a guy to do it. There's going to be so many sprinkles in my beard. Sparkles? Sprinkles? No, literally. <laughs> so many sprinkles? No, yeah, forget your glitter, just get sprinkles and <laughs> get in your beard. Don't be man sprinkles. Uh, looking at Chris makes me upset. What's your problem, Juice? Or, uh, not Juice. Juicea. How many cards this guy got in his deck? It's at the top. The library is next to his hand. Yep. So we're still a few away from Shell.com. Oh, we have to start drawing some good shit here. We gotta hope that we can not get this our This is like our sixth off. fog. Six. And we gained five life off of the... The elixir. We yeah. could be at eight. <laughs> just saying. That's funny. I like that you're just saying. Just saying. Calinade tapped. Uh oh. No ghost quarters. Good thing. We got this ethereal haze, though. That's good. Let's draw some cards. Always yield. Ah, oh, shit. I will. Oh, shit. I will next time. Got your staff in. Oh, my Cannot God. Cannot play Three, it. Do not play it. Four or five. You could if you had some ghost quarters. <laughs> Sorry, I'm sorry. I'm just poking you. You're fucking. I'm sorry. You're triggering the shit out of uh, me. Oh, did you talk to Seth? Better know to Saffron Olives about the jankiness of this deck beforehand. No, we just got it from Seth. Better know to Saffron Olives from MTG Goldfish, but we didn't talk to him about how janky it is. I fucking hate Shell Dock Isle. Uh, is it your turn or his turn? It's his turn. turn. All right, on his end cast. step, uh, get this, get this fucking Sphinx's tutelage off the Shell Dock into the field you got it i hope you got it we might i think we make how does he not have a counter spell how has he not countered anything that mattered here i don't know you might actually have to you might have to shell dock first to see if he'll counter that how, do, how much does this cost make it big again no, the, the aisle she the aisle make the aisle oh. Uh, you may play the Exile card without paying its mana cost if a library has 20 or fewer cards in it. Okay, just cast that now. Okay. I want to see if he'll counter this. I have no idea how to make it actually... Okay, click it. 
Oh, it worked. It worked. That's what we had to do. We had to click on it and, so cl- and it cast. Fucking stupid moto. It's totally not intuitive. Ooh, we actually gonna draw out the counter spell? Counter bounce. Counter bounce. Counter bounce, baby. You can do it. You can do it. He bounced the howling mind. Ooh, nice. Okay. We're okay with this. Now we wanna put Now yeah, now you wanna haze. I want a haze. I want a haze. Because he mother- can't, he can't logic not. He might have a negate main board, but there we go. Okay, so we're still insulated from a burn spell. Nice. Blocks, no blocks. We don't care. Yeah, I don't think it was worth countering that. That's interesting. Field of ruin. Oh, he could have got our shell dog out. Sweet. Let's go get a land. Um, he has to search first, I guess. We want to get a blue source. Yeah, get a blue source. It's like whatever, I guess. Okay. Holy day! Oh, holy day. Um, can you staff him in and holy day? No, you Three, cannot. Six. Son of a bitch. <sighs> All right, play the Howling Mine. Yeah, Howling Mine. Every day. Oh, this staffing in. God, it's it's just it's it's taunting me. It is taunting you. What was this gonna be instead? What did we cut? Um, a temple bell. Yeah, it would have been another temple bell. We probably would have been. We, <laughs> we would have won by now. That, yeah. We would have won by now. Oh man, that's funny. If we had enough lands, though, we'd be killing off these snapcasters. It's that, it's that colony that's really scary. We're down four minutes right now, so I'm gonna try to pick my speed up. Where are you gonna, where are you gonna put it? <laughs> put it right inside your ear. Oh! I'm gonna put it inside your, inside your ear. Your rear or your ear? <laughs> you get it. Good enough. Oh, right, holy day. Holy day. We may get this through. Let's see if we do. He's got seven cards in hand. He's only counting. Oh, he's dead. You see how quickly he that mana? Holy uh, shit. Uh, <sighs> All right, so this plus another electrolyze, or just another bolt. Yeah, we just we just dead here, dog. Yeah, it's a bad matchup. It's our second one, just straight up bad matchup. Yeah, we couldn't play against creature decks the whole time. I know, right? We only seen one John. Ball sacks. And we barely saw it. Okay. Oh look, a temple bell. <laughs> now it's really taunting me. Uh, you have to play it and hope that it resolves, and you have to activate it so that we draw. What? You have to play the temple bell. Oh yeah, you're right. Play with your basics. Play with your basics. Um, I don't think you can play the howling mine because we haven't seen dawn charm, so we have to keep two mana open. Uh, I don't know if you do that now or if you just do it. Yeah, you have to do it now. Because we have to get a Dawn Charm before they're able to shoot at us. Yeah, it's something. We just milled, so he's down to four cards. <gasps> wait a second, wait a second. He's down to four cards? Yeah. Okay. Ooh, ooh we can cycle. <laughs> okay, wait, wait, wait. We, let's cycle. You cycle, that's two cards, and then he... Wait, 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 wait. If you cycle, that's two cards. What's the odds that he just doesn't have another burn spell in his deck? I'm cycling, I don't get No, don't, don't. To you. Please don't, please don't. Because if you cycle and you hit a land, we die. Because he still has a card left in his library unless we hit exactly two things that have the same color. He's a three-color deck with, like, 26, 27 lands. Yeah, but he's going to die during his upkeep, isn't he? No. Oh, no, he could just burn us out. No, he won't die during his upkeep because there's only two cards okay, coming off the top. how do I undo this basic? You, like this. Okay, so okay. then... I think that we're going to try and resolve this. So if he goes to shoot you... <sighs> Can we make him draw cards? No. We gotta cycle. That's our only out. I'm cycling. Wait, it's not our... Oh, wait, Josh. It's not our only out. <laughs> we got 13 minutes. Come on. Make a decision. It this does... Is gonna... I'm, I was thinking... Okay, listen. <laughs> we can't. We can kill him next turn. We can't kill him this turn. You cycle right now. He's he, cast it on he, he mills two things. 
Josiah's saying cast uh, Angel Song on upheat. Yes, I agree with that. Yes, I agree with that. Go to go to right click sure? on it. Yes, go to the upkeep. Okay. Right click on it. Stop on opponent's turn. Yes, I like this because he won't okay. get the opportunity to have drawn cards, so then and then you can just cast the angel. We're gonna, we're gonna okay. So we die to a burn spell, but I don't think he has any left. He does. He's got burn spells less. We're so we're both so fucking dead. Click on this real quick. Click on this allow from Josiah because he's a bitch. Now click back over here. He said, "Cycle it, you pussy." <laughs> yeah, don't, don't, just, just, just keep going. Just keep going. Don't cycle it. I'm cycling it. No, it, no, Josh. Listen, listen. I'll explain. I'll explain because we spent five minutes on this now. If you cycle this, we draw a card. He mills two, goes to two in library, draws for. Whoa. Okay. Just shut up. We're already, I already passed. The C- cast the angel song. Cast it. Holy shit! This is so stupid. I'm telling you, we should have fucking just... We should have cycled. There's no burn spells left. Snap! Oh, God! We're dead. It's gotta be a snap. He only has one red source. That's what it was. Oh, it's a negate! We were dead anyways. <laughs> Josiah, I hate him. There's... It wouldn't... I hate him. Josh, it wouldn't have worked. It wouldn't have worked. You, you, you have a better out this way. Because if you cycle it, he loses two cards draws and has one in library still shut up josiah we could hit double cards dog <sighs> you should you should tell him hey draw those last cards and show them to us draw a card let me see draw a card me draw a card yeah draw a card yeah we definitely won if we got one more turn we went first, though. Yeah, but we need one more turn. Ah, oh, god damn it. Keep dying to these ambush vipers. We're a fog deck. I don't get it. This deck is not good. It's got too many, like... Dr- the problem is these howling mines... They just shouldn't be there, or what? Well, you need some kind of... You need a two-drop of some kind, obviously. Uh, the Sphinx's tutelage are a must... The dictates are fine because you get the first card advantage off them. The Howling Mines are bad because your opponent gets the first advantage off them. The Temple Bells are okay because you can, again, you control who gets the card, when they get the card. All right, what did we take out last time? Maybe we should just play a Jace, though. Yeah, somebody recommended that, and I liked it. All right, so we're, we're bringing in uh, four, eight, nine, ten. We're bringing in Angel, ten cards. Angel's Grace is out. Yep. Yeah. So what, we did the same exact thing last time. The staff came out. We took out Ethereal Haze, right? Yeah, we took out either Haze or Holy Day. Either one, doesn't matter. I'm not taking staff in and out this time. Okay, you need to cut four more cards. The rest of it is the combo package. We took Verdicts out, didn't we? You took a Verdict out. I think you left one. Yeah, I know. I, I know it's not truly Fog. Three, seven, eight, nine, ten. Would this just be better as like how many blue where, green can we see deck? How many cards are in our side? Oh, twelve. Okay, so three cards. Right here, it says you have sixty-three in your main. Okay, so <gasps> Dawn charms are good. The pollen, I guess, can come out. Um, I really hate Howling Mine, but you gotta have them. Cut a howling mind. Cut the white border howling mind. <laughs> <laughs> Cut the white border one. <laughs> Fuck you, whiteboard cards. Shit. Oh god, man, this is so depressing. We keep playing against this. We're fucking. Do we need to play against creature decks, and we're not getting creature I decks? I know. Yeah, I want to play first, bitch. Bitch. Um, it's kind of medium. It's got a negate and a it's, relic, though. It's more than medium, but we don't have double blue source for this thing, but we'll draw it. We got a billion turns. Okay. We're keeping. Okay. All right. I think I'm going to Kwai. I think you're going to Tilt. I think I'm going to Kwai. Hey, you going to play land? Sure. Holophone, uh, holophone, holophone. Really? Tapped? Or tapped, relic? tapped, tapped, tapped. We're not going to play relic tapped, on one, and we're going to let it get countered? Tapped, 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 tapped. <sighs> you i want to let you know that that last game that that two points wouldn't have mattered by the way 
Because he hit us for four. We were at two. Uh, let's see. Josiah wants to know if you're going to be at Panadol tomorrow, Josh. No, because there's no legacy tomorrow. Why are you not playing Relic on one? Because what's he going to counter it with? Yeah, nothing. What are we going to... Spell Pierce. Who cares? Let him use his Spell Pierce. No, I'm talking to Josiah. I know. Don't just... Don't. Don't, Don't talk to Josiah. Josiah. Fuck you, Josiah. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> All right, we got I love ten you. minutes. This guy's got seventeen minutes. That's bad. Right, well, start using your six a little bit. You get to hold the gate on too, because he's gonna cast something on his turn too that we want to negate. Our negate gets held up until we can sphinx his tutelage and protect it. What's he gonna cast on two that you would want to negate, Josiah? Search for ass cancer. Don't care. We have ghost quarter in hand. Don't care. Relic plus ghost quarter. Search for ass cancer. Don't care. Hey, buddy, take the you can take the reins. What? Why? You're doing fine. Calling. Oh, the wife's calling. Hi, Julie. Uh, okay, what the hell am I doing? <laughs> I hope you guys can't hear their phone call. Okay. Um. Can ghost quarter this? Play another ghost quarter. I am just going to get away from the logic knot and make him use a different counter spell. Cause whatever. Straight in the gate, go. <laughs> Trying to also not listen to their conversation. Hmm. I'm going to end up ghost quartering my land and dictate a crew fixing on his end step, I think. Maybe we can get him to field me. That'd be great. But he's not going to do it. Okay, where are we at? Uh, it is my turn somehow. Did I have six? Why is it not giving me the end step? Okay, so can I do this? Can I go Ghost Quarter? It has to be a non-basic, right? Destroy a target land? No, target land. So blow this up, go get a island. Float the white. Sacrifice Ghost Quarter, destroy this. Try and get him to Cryptic here so that I can land the Sphinx's Tutelage. Are you gonna try and blow up one of my lands? He is trying to blow up a land. I don't think I care about that. Why would I care about this? I get to go get another basic, comes in untapped. I blow up his, he only gets a land, I don't get a land. I want to get a land. This is fine. I can't take him off of any of his colors here. Island. Island. Okay. I should have always.
always yielded. Shell Dock Isle, we're super far away from that. Let's play the Colonnade. He's got two up. It's kind of risky. It's kind of risky. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it anyways. Risk it for the biscuit. Got there. Okay. What you got, Just Guy? Should have yielded to that one, too. It's pretty good getting him to use his land, or get to use his mana on his uh, turn there. To furry. This is going to be bad. Do I have enough to activate this? One, two, three. Nope. That's bad. Uh. Josiah, it's your favorite card. Okay. Wow. He had a lot of stuff that time. His logic knots are super live now. This costs five to activate. One, two, three. There's no freaking way. Shell dock's okay here. Colony doesn't matter. Let's see what we get. These fogs are just so mediocre. Maybe we should cut more fogs. Um, Josh is going to tell me that we want the ley line. Take the lid on. At this point, I don't. I like we gotta keep this around for a search for Ascanta, but his logic knots are all of a sudden really scary, and it's because we did it. It's a really bad matchup. You have to untap two lands. Aw, oh, dang it. I was really hoping he would miss it and just untap our shell like all. Okay. Trigger. Aha, I got your logic now. Drew another relic. Ooh, got a secure. Um, we're going to crack this one. Try to get another use out of the tutelage. Okay. Let's have 30 cards in library. Twenty life. What are you gonna do, guy? You so scared of this relic? He's gonna get the negate. Counter spell, draw a card. What? Son of a bitch. Okay. It's so much... It's so much quieter without Josh. I miss him. Why the fuck are we playing this deck? Seventeen. Halo. 
of the Sphinx is tutelage clever. Good draw. He's not gonna have path, right? One, two, three, four, five, attack the. not going to have pass anymore. He's going to have cryptic that he's going to use here. He wants me in combat first. Which is right because I could tap and play the relic if he didn't let me move into combat first. I know I have five minutes but this is a fucking nightmare match. We wanted to play against creature decks today and we get fucking two Jeskai decks. Cryptic. Tap bounce. And just straight bounce. Turn to hand. What's the other part of it? F6 through his turn. So what did he do? Cast Cryptic targeting Celestial Colonnade, return to hand. I guess that just auto locks the other one to draw a card. I don't like that this doesn't announce it. Son of a bitch. Seven cards in hand. Stab him in. Bajna. <laughs> Ceremonious rejection. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Fuck it. I'm going to get the cast. Josh is stabbing in before him. <laughs> it's not going to resolve, though. Fuck. And now we have an ambush viper. That's too good. That's too good. Well done, sir. Well done. Alright, we'll take our two. Oh boy. Still not online. Guru Master, attack us. This is just painful. He's just gonna, he's on the time I'm out and plan now. This is painful. It's probably painful to be on the other side of too, but this is painful. Yeah, I don't care about your logic. Not, I'm not paying seven. Take two. Thought he was gonna just try and time us out. Okay. I'm gonna cast the ley line that's under the shell dock aisle on his turn, and hopefully this negate's gonna be good enough. Take two.
is not gonna be good enough. Disdainful stroke. Where's your other logic knots? Snapcaster logic knot. You should just play the rest in peace. Instead of the relics, who cares? I wonder if that disrupts the Sphinx's tutelage combo. I don't think it does. What are you going for here, dude? I have no idea what this guy is casting. There we go. Fucking finally. Are we getting logic knotted our face off? Fucking right now? hell. So <laughs> annoying. I come back and you're logic. You're getting logic knotted. Oh, you D stroke that? Yeah. Gross. Yep. Uh, I do want to say that I got to cast the, uh, whatchamacallit, before you. The staff. I got to cast the staff before you. You did? Mm hmm. It didn't resolve, but I got to cast it. That's why I love you. <laughs> I thought he was just going to time us out, but then he started attacking again. I'm not exactly sure why, like, we're in a really bad spot. He still has a billion burn spells. What are you thinking? This is the one <laughs> Don't squish my head! My head! <laughs> uh, yep. All right, so I went and talked to the wife. Everything is good. Good, good. I did, I, I'm not angry at her anymore yeah, for waking you, up. Yeah, you guys seemed really cute. I had to close the door because I'm just like, these fucking happy people. Yeah, sorry. Can't stand I'm them. I'm sorry I was being happy. Fucking awful. I know, it's disgusting. I'm going to try and block with the colonnade this turn. Ooh, colonnade's actually going to become two, useful. Three, four, five. Probably not. We'll probably, <laughs> probably die. I don't know. And then you have we have. I don't think I activated this auto Zed stuff. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Who the fuck knows? He's got fifteen cards in his sideboard. Yeah. Baby. Gee, fucking that's that's extreme. <laughs> what? Nothing. Don't read it. It's extreme. Each player draws a card. Draw a card! Oh, fucking hell. We dead? Not quite, but we're really close. We're getting close. Snap, snap bolt will basically do it. Oh my god! He's got a hand. Oh my god! Snapcaster. You fucking prick. Oh, <laughs> Why did we not play against creature decks, man? It's okay, we're gonna win the next round. Hold on, I'm gonna holy day this bitch. And we're gonna be two watch and this, three. Watch this, watch this, watch this. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking holy day this motherfucker. You just waste this guy's time. Yep. You wasted mine with all these stupid logic knots, man. So annoying. Tommy clean up. Bye. Bye, Tommy. Fuck. All right, you went back in for the last one? No. Or do you want me to? Yeah, you, you need out. <laughs> this deck. You need out. Oh, my hey, God. Listen, I love what? who you there's, are. There's nothing worse than dying to... Ambush vipers. I love who you are, and I love who you ain't. And I ain't, I ain't a turbo fog. You not a, a modern, not, not a modern turbo fog. No. I don't even like, like I like tutelage in, uh, in standard. Two three dream baby. I didn't play a bunch of fog Two, stuff three, with it. Dream. I played a bunch of draw stuff with it. It was just draw cycle 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 draw draw draw. We're going the two three dream. We better. You know what? Come we didn't on, even creature do this deck. Week. Hold on. You we know didn't we even, didn't. Yeah, we didn't call do over under. Yeah. Because we pro I think both I didn't of us want to, literally I didn't thought want to tell the deck you, but was awful. No, I thought we were going to go 4-1. Seriously? Because we thought the deck was awful, I thought we were going to go 4 <laughs> <laughs> I thought that maybe because like we were so down on it that we just like get our like undefeated trophy or whatever the hell it is. Dude, we're going to... Just wait until next week. We are going to fucking smash with my deck, I promise you. I am going to... I'm excited for it, but I'm going to have to just like question you and be like, Josh, why this? Yeah, just slow because down I have that. no idea what the fuck. Just slow, yeah, just slow me down. I only bit. know how to go for a uh, 
a blood crypt on the first turn. Yeah, that's all you know. Is this fine? No, fuck no, it's not. No? No, we need more land than one land. Okay. Yeah, especially with the verdict, you're right. Oh, yeah, okay, fuck. I'm keeping that. Don't you dare keep that. I'm keeping it. No, you can't cast anything. It's not worth it. You son of a bitch. And an angel's grace? Put it on the bottom. It's our worst fog. Unless, unless, unless we play against burn. Storm. Storm, yeah, not Burn. <laughs> if we open up against Storm. Oh, motherfucking. Go! Go! Colony tapped! Uh, what? Hey. What do you care? This isn't Storm. It doesn't matter. It's fucking not a creature deck. We didn't even get to fucking do shit. Play the, the island so our Glacial Fortress is coming untapped. Or the Sheldock Isle. One or the other. It is. It's Sheldock Isle. Alright. Fucking balls. Get the tutelage. Any order. I know. Fuck me. I'm so... I'm a, little, so I'm a little sad. tilted, too, because we didn't play against any creature decks. The one creature deck that we did get auto-scooped to if, us. If we were playing if we were playing my burn deck today, we would just be pushing shit in so hard right now. Colonnade, go. Fucking Jeskai. What the fuck? Three rounds of Jeskai. Like, I like Jeskai. That's a weird bolt. That is a weird bolt. That's pretty. I like Jeskai, but damn. Uh, yeah, fountain, fountain tapped. Good thing we got this verdict. <laughs> okay. I'm we're, like, well, just in case we see creatures. We're so anti-creatures, and we didn't fucking play any. No. The one creature deck we played is like a combo creature deck, I guess. I don't know. Oh, he baby. just had all of his pieces, and he just killed us really fast. Did he bolt snap bolt us already? Yeah, he snapped bolt us. Wow. Oh. We're just getting our fucking shit pushed in. Wow. Um. I think you just verdicts. I honestly think you just verdicts. You're right. I think you're right. Actually, it's the worst. Like, and then just... he's gonna. He's just gonna. He's just gonna dump in a snapcaster. So yeah, he could dump in a snapcaster. It's true. It's whatever. Screen verdict. I think we we verdict and hopefully he doesn't get another white source and then we can play this ghost quarter. Oh my god, just guy again. It is tilting. This is it's, this is hard not to tilt against. This is tilting. This is the tiltiest. <laughs> the tiltiest? This is the tiltiest. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, at least we got this. We're going to shoot him down. We we we're never going to resolve it. <laughs> <laughs> Look at oh these warrior tokens. God. We're gonna die to these warrior tokens. It's gonna be great. Holy shit. Hey, we wanted to play against creature decks, right? <laughs> yep, we are. We're playing against creatures. I hope we top deck our, our second supreme verdict right here. No, that's not bad. Oh my fucking god. This is so depressing. Probably should have played the ghost quarter there, but okay. Whatever. We're fucking dead. Um, past turn. Yep, F6, our face is off. And let's just what is that? read the pollen thing because nobody knows what this card does. Prevent all combat damage that would be dealt this turn. Clash with an opponent. If you win, creatures that player controls don't untap during their next that player's next untap step. Okay. Sick. Wow. Wow. Oh, We're at fucking out. four, Josh. Oh, he's tapping out. Holy shit. Fuck these chest guy decks. Okay, pollen him. Let's clash. I hope we win the clash. Re pull it up again. Where? Yeah, do the double thing. Elixir of Immortality versus one, so we didn't win. Shit. Uh, the elixir is also like we have to have the elixir as well. So put it on top. Yeah, elixir on top is fine. Okay. But we, yeah, we didn't win the clash. Okay. Yep, no blockers. Yeah, 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 yeah. God, sand blockers to the double piece. Okay, after this, we're going to play a, uh, a casual match, too. 
Really? Yeah. Because fuck Chess Guy. <laughs> we've never done that before. We've never played extra magic. I like no, that. No, we've not. But we we didn't really play magic today either. Uh, well, when we resolve the staff in and, and shoot down one of the sand warriors, we're he's gonna a, win. Well, he's gonna logic knot us. Whatever. We well, don't care. We're just gonna run this. Play we're just gonna run this out. Why? Because we're gonna die to the colonnade. You can't play the staff and then. You're right. So play the elixir of immortality, I guess. It doesn't matter. Yeah. The scoop match gave you extra time. <laughs> yeah, you're right, Rash. You're right. <laughs> the scoop match gave us extra time. You goddamn right. We you did win. We we won a match. Yeah. Fuck, it's stupid. I okay, scoop. Don't hit any. Oh, or, what, or during his upkeep, I should have. We should have cracked that. Um, we want to crack this in response. Can't we do it? We'll just do it on his end step, right? No, we're doing it right fucking now. Right now. Yeah, in response yeah. to him drawing a card. Yeah, yeah. Should you're right. Upkeep would have been better. Whatever. This is, dude. Online magic is so much harder than paper magic. I'm so you don't much get to, better at You don't get to magic. read your opponent either. No, I am so I much better. I love reading people. I'm so much better at paper magic. I can't wait to talk about nationals. And tonight? Yeah, tonight on uh, Magic After Dark. Why? Because, like, I had a lot of fun, and I got to play against people and and read them and walk them into bad lines, and it was great. It was really enjoyable. We get to talk about competitive draft and draft for uh, Core 19. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we do. Tougher, so stupid. Fucking tougher. Holy day! Okay, can we actually. We can cast Daphidim and Nin and hold up a fucking holy day. I'm so excited. Alright, that's what we gotta do. Do we have extra land? Can we keep the ghost quarter too or no? No, we only have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven land up. Okay. Jump over to the shell dock after this one. I don't want you to leave us with, you know, just a blue accidentally. Ooh, I just cast Stefanin in modern online. Woo! I didn't think he was going to get to do it. I was going to hold it over his head that I did and he didn't. He's like, what does this card do? I've never seen this before. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> I'm sorry, I should hit the fucking mic table. Don't you dare. <laughs> you, just, you just keep on, keep it on. You read Dugit, you make him kill you. Nope. <laughs> uh, oh, I can't cast Daffin in? I concede. You, at least, you cast it. I fucking concede. You got to cast it. We need another need... verdict. Oh, uh, God. Maybe we should have probably bid there. Uh, we have to take this three. Did we haze the other turn? Are you sure we gotta take that three? No. Dumbass. Ooh, searching for ass cancer. Everybody loves that. I know we can't take another three. Yeah, damn right we can't. Good thing we got a ghost quarter. <laughs> Oh, baby, oh, top decks of the century. God, the Shell Dock Isle is so useful. Oh, my God. What a great mana base. Uh, Don't eat, do you, Yeah, just fucking play it. Who the fuck cares? No. Why not? You're right. I'm just going to play it. When he flips his fucking search for S Cancer, um, goes quarter, and he'll get one activation out of it, but he'll be tapped pretty low. Not now. He's got to flip it first. And his... Draw step? Yeah, right click is draw step. Hit okay. I don't think this is going to matter because he's going to have a trigger there, so we'll get priority, but just in case. Yeah. We're definitely getting used to the deck. We're only like three minutes behind this time. Yeah, we are we are saving some time. That's what I like to see. Oh, yo. Don't bolt us. Don't snap bolt us. Just snap bolt us and get it over with so we can fucking sideboard and lose this game. <laughs> Shit, is this the first game? 
Yeah. Fuck my life. This is the first game. It's so painful. It is really painful to play against control with this deck. Because they're just doing just they're doing nothing. exactly they're doing exactly what we're doing. They're just doing it fucking better. Yeah. And that's not fun. <laughs> no, it's not fun. It's like it's just the worst. You're playing with way better cards. It's not yeah. fun. It's only but, fun when you're fucking janking it up. Yeah, you're right. Alright. And okay, and flippity flip. Flippity flip flop. Flippity then flop. Then we're gonna go to Ghost Quarter, and then he's gonna, he's gonna activate it in response and kill us. Alright, no, Ghost Quarter him. And then when he goes to activate it, holy day. Yeah, I think I think we avoid one more counter spell here if we just holy day right now. He's gonna snap bolt us. I hope all right, so. Alright, 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 cast it, cast it. This is gonna be great. Stupid deck. You're playing against nothing but control. <laughs> We're just getting punished. Control right now. and combo. Oh, here comes the logic knot. Why does it always have to be? Thank God. Thank Thank God it's not a logic knot. It's snapcaster lightning bolt. That card is so though. annoying online. What does he got? Snapcaster bolt. lightning bolt. We're dead. <laughs> You're like, oh, thank God we're dead. Thank God we're dead. It's painful. It's so painful. Mm. Yay! <laughs> okay. Alright, so we know exactly what to bring in and what to take out. Take in all the negates, all the relics, all the ley lines. And then we just lose the match anyway. And then we just lose the match anyways. What if we win a game? We haven't won a game against Control yet. No, get rid of the staff, please. We even... I think we might need a verdict. <laughs> really? He, he showed us the... Uh, the last two Jeskai players we put against did have uh, Secure the Ways. Okay. I think we gotta get rid of that and a bunch of the fucking fogs in all reality. Let's bring Burt and Forge Tender in this time. Why? Because we can at least... <gasps> yeah, yeah, why are we not bringing that in? I don't know, because we're fucking... Bring those in. We're fucking retards. Bring those in. Fuck yeah. Okay, <laughs> what are you doing? I'm, I'm putting this here so that everybody can see what we're sideboarding, just in case somebody wants to watch us play this deck. You don't think that's going to happen? You're, playing, you're doing this in the jankiest way possible. <laughs> I'm just, I'm a little slow. Oh my god. Alright, so... Is there anything else to the sideboard or that fucking mess of a sideboard that you want? I've got mouse to feed. I'm bringing a disenchant in. Don't care. Yeah, sure. I don't... Let's see if it fucking does anything. I mean, it's, it might we hit can, ass cancer. Yeah, we can hit the, the yeah, search, I hit, guess. You can hit an ass cancer. Yeah, we want to play first. Fuck. <laughs> it's painful, man. Three Jeskai decks? Yeah. A mole... Ah, oh, Jesus. Mo. <laughs> I'm keeping this. Don't keep that shit. Why? Because Fog is our worst fucking card against them. This is just a fucking think twice that doesn't think on the other end. Look at you get to play Relic on one. Aren't you guys excited? <laughs> I am very excited. No, Josiah. Josiah's. Yeah, we're playing. We're Josiah's playing changing his shorts right now. He is. Hey, I, I thought he said if if we played Relic on one, he. Oh, eat his here shorts. remove that draw step thing. Yeah. Uh, how do I mind? Did you drink the water and flit before starting? <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! Don't drink the water. Why is that still a fucking issue? Because. Why have they not resolved that? Because there's people there that don't care about that shit. Well, that's really fucked up. Yeah. I love the water here, though. The water here is okay. In the down river. I like uh, Ice Mountain. I'm going to relic the shit out of that flooded strand, bitch. You better don't better don't crack it. Ancestral Visions! I don't think that... Have we seen that at all? Has anyone been playing that? Are we just against straight blue white now? Did he change decks? He took the red out? <laughs> Oh, no third land that's cool um I'll, always you'll do that shit third land come on baby come on baby draw that card oh, oh my fucking my god lord. 
Okay. Do we just crack the relic okay. here? No. The relic's too good. You have to worry about their goddamn logic knot and snapcaster baloney. Baloney. Dude, while you were away, I fucking... Oh, ancestral visions. Yeah, I said that. Hmm. Um, I cracked a relic to play another relic. And, like, we fought over it with counter spells and shit like that. Mm -hmm. And there was a turn where we actually got to relic and then immediately put seven cards in his graveyard because of our Sinks of Tutelage. I was like, this like this the first game. I was like, this fucking sucks. This is a horrible combo. Yeah. It should literally just be... Um, wow. <laughs> <sighs> Do you want to cycle that one for a land? Yeah. Go for it. Um. Yeah, go for it. How'd that logic not get in this graveyard? I don't know. Well, let's relic it. Relic it? Yeah, use your relic. You're right. <clears throat> that will get resolved before you... <laughs> Before your staff of men. <laughs> They'll fix the water and flit before we get to resolve a staff of men. I like that. That's funny, I see. That is fucking funny. Oh, he had too many cards in hand because they were howling mine. Oh, sweet. Yeah. He's like, I'll just discard this counter yeah. spell. Oh, just, fuck it, I don't need this. He's just gonna cream pie in our face. Anyways. I've got, oh shit, I've got 17 points of burn in my hand. I'm a fucking control deck. Oh, fuck. Sand Warriors, baby. They're gonna Good thing we got us. the Supreme Verdict that we can't cast yet. Okay. If we don't draw a land here, I'm fucking cracking this relic. I don't think you're cracking the relic. Why would you crack the relic? Because we do. We need a verdict. No, we don't. We're at 20. We can go to like 12 or something before we have to verdict. I hate everything you stand for. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I was in the chat right now, and I was just not playing with you. That's so funny. <laughs> I wish I was in the chat right now and not playing with you. Yeah, I wish I, I was, was so chat. lonely without you. Oh, God. I was like, I don't know what to say. I wasn't prepared to do this by myself. Come on, Lance. Listen, you're just going to play just What play the awful. fuck? Look at this. This shit's fucking the worst, dude. Dude, play the, play the Howling Mind. <laughs> play the fucking Howling Mind. Do it. I hate this deck right now. Oh, this is great. I hope he counters it too. He's just like, nah, fuck you. <laughs> nah, you ain't drawing no more cards. He's like, he's like, like, I don't want to have to do any more yeah, cleanup steps. Yeah. He's like, this he's is... gonna counter. He's gonna logic knot yeah. it. Fuck so logic knot. So he doesn't have to draw cards. Oh, that card's so stupid. No, tell it no. No, I hate that card so much. All right, All right Josh, you don't even have the mana to do it anymore. So, all right. Things out of the waste before cracking relic. What would that do? We don't we don't get to we don't get to target what card gets exiled. That would be so much better. Uh, we just get to target the player, and the player gets to choose what card they want to exile from their graveyard. Yeah. Relic with target card and graveyard like Scoo's ability would be amazing. All right, now we want to be able to verdict. How great would it have been if he had just targeted the waste and just made one more warrior? <laughs> just to fucking pwn us. Yeah. I mean, I would send that message. Easy. Easy poner. I mean, shit, he's at 12 life. <laughs> we could get him. He is at 12 life. You have priority. Yeah. Smart ass. Okay. Come on, land. We got land. We got double land. Uh, don't play the Ghost Court. I'll play the Fortress. You can do... i just cast that on his end stuff, I guess. Yeah, dictate. And yeah, do we have eight cards in hand? Yeah, we have eight cards in hand. We're going to discard... Are we going to discard the Bell? Yeah, Temple Bell. Or the Dictate? No. Okay. No. Bell. Alright. Moved it clean up. Um, well... Maybe, I don't know, are we supposed to relic on our turn or we should be relicking on his turn? Yeah, we should be relicking on his turn. He okay. Got two again. Oh okay. my god. Oh, uh, you could darn, Dawn Charm this. Mm, but we can Dawn Charm during combat. Right, that's four damage versus three damage. Yeah. 
Uh, you can give your ley line and sanctity uh, flash. <laughs> Double bell. Oh shit! Counter his uh, ancestral vision. Cast. Uh, oh, we didn't put my card in. We put your uh, your your staff in, him, but we didn't put in my uh, mana type. Do we want to do what? relic it right now? Why? Because it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Let him let him put nine cards in his hand. Jesus Christ, he's casting this thing. Unfucking believable. He's got eleven cards in hand. He's milling himself harder than we're milling him. And he does. And he's winning. <laughs> and he's winning. He's doing the job for us. He's doing the mill. Oh my god. Are we dawn charming this turn? And then no, we're we're dictating this turn. And the next turn we're um, playing the supreme uh, supreme verdict, right? Just get rid of the vision. Nope. What did he get rid of? Logic not? Okay. Okay. No, 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 no. What? Go to his end step. See if he casts something. Maybe... I'm fucking Dawn Charming. No. I don't want to take this damage. Okay, take the. don't take the damage then. Holy fuck. I don't know when you're going to get to dictate. Who cares? <laughs> We're fucking so dead it's retarded. It's pretty fucking retarded. We're trying to live right now. All right. Well then, let's go. When he moves to his end, I'm cracking fucking relic. You really hate relic. I'm cracking it. I don't care. That's fine. Maybe he'll try and snap bolt us. Oh, oh my <laughs> fucking god! Hold on. Let me zoom in on this. What does what does Vendillion click do? It says. It says I fuck you. your world. It says I pwn your ass. All right, we're gonna we're gonna redraw it anyways. I'm gonna respond. Sure. No, I'm not. I'm no, not yeah, because it'll give us two draws. Two draws. Yeah, let it go. Let it go. Monday. Oh, fuck. Get rid of the supreme verdict, you fucking piece of shit. God, you're good at magic. Fuck <laughs> Josh. And okay. Oh, I'm so tilted right now. <laughs> Is this what it's like to be you? Yes. Is this what it feels like to be Chris? Perry? Absolutely. Except when they slow roll me and I've been at three life for forever and they've had ten cards in their hand. And then I finally cast something and they're like, Buy triple, Supreme tri Verdict. Triple Bulltru? We drew a Sphinx's tutelage wait, wait, wait. the Supreme Verdict. Okay, now crack the relic because we I want am, a new draw. I am, I am. I thought it was going to auto-pass you or something. He should have done that in our draw step. Yeah, he should have. Oh, Forge tender. Come on, two cards. Clean up. He's got a discard one. Oh boy. Oh my god. <laughs> we don't have any fucking fogs, dude. Do you want to play a land and play the ley line now? No, because we're just going to die to a beatdown. Alright, well then play a land, play the Burnington Forge tender, and then play Dictator Crucifix on his turn. Oh, you have to play a Ghost Quarter. Wait, 4, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. You have to play the Ghost Quarter. And then play a Force Thunder. <laughs> I believe in you! <laughs> He's like double bolt in response. <laughs> I almost spewed pop everywhere. <laughs> Oh, God. Oh, boy. All right. This is like watching old people fuck. I'll <laughs> <laughs> have to get a mini screen next time, and when we stream a deck like this, just, just have it streaming right next to we'll it. We'll just play it every time somebody hits follow. Right, hey, hit so, follow, by the way. Also, go go to enter the raffle to win a revised pack. Go to our YouTube hell page. yeah. Miles Basement Games on YouTube. Uh, subscribe to the channel. Find any... Find any of the Magic Afternoon series stuff. Leave a comment in the comment section. Tell us what is one of your favorite decks or a deck that you'd like to see us play on Magic Afternoon. That puts you in the raffle tonight at, I don't know, middle of our show, end yeah. of our show, somewhere in our show for Magic After Dark that goes on later tonight. And if you uh, miss it, you can rewatch it on you YouTube. You can rewatch it on YouTube. 
Find and out if you uh, will. the winner will win a pack, um, a sealed pack of revised that has like the best dual land in it, probably. And it's not. Uh, it is one hundred percent. What did you just do? I ghost quartered his uh, thing during his upkeep. Why? Because I wanted to. Because I'm the fucking boss. But Josh, you wait till he goes to combat to see if he actually activates it, and then if he doesn't activate it, you just dictate. Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> Sorry, I wasn't paying any attention to what you were doing over here. Don't tell me what to do. God damn it, Josh. We're so dead. Are you going to block, or...? No, I'm not going to block. You could block the, the Snapcaster and, and basically remove two points that's coming at you every turn. We're gonna go find a creature deck and we're gonna have a good time. Let's play my deck. Next I one. don't have I don't have time to pull it together. You don't? No, it's it's after four o'clock now. Oh damn. We, and you don't I don't think you have it completely built, right? Yeah, I do have it completely built. Oh maybe we could pull it together. <clears throat> I think we could. And then we can practice for next week. We can give these guys a preview of what's gonna come. Oh, yep, scoop. Sure. I mean, look at this. We don't. Just, we can't even fog. Yeah, just get out of this. We can't fog. Just get out of this. All right, guys. Well, you got to watch us see Blue White Turbo Fog. We won one round because someone I okayed and scooped to us. Yep. Uh, that was a win in my book. We played three Jeskai played, decks. Yeah, we played against three Jeskai decks. So uh, really this bad wasn't. Matchup. So I'd have to say, like, this isn't. This isn't really. Um, this isn't a good look at what the deck can do. I don't think in modern. Um, but I think the deck, I think the deck is legitimate if you're in a creature heavy meta along with maybe a burn heavy meta, even um, I would just, uh, affinity. I would just play the the, the blue, deck is just. I would just play blue green personally though, because you just blue get green. yeah. Because I just want I just want different types of of green spells. Yeah, you still get all the negates and everything like that. Ley lines you can you can play off of stuff. Yeah. So this was this was the deck that we ran today, um, and. The card that really shined was Staff of Nin. No shining. That was that was not a shiny. It shined in my heart. Yeah, it shined in your heart. Your heart's real big though. <laughs> so this is dark. Um, yeah. So, all right. So we. Why would you play blue green though? I don't know. I just. I'm more of a green player. Like, I don't like these white cards. Is my problem. Okay. Yeah, it's not foil at all, Rash. It's not. All right, so uh, we're going to play a non-competitive league right now, or, well, a non-competitive game, uh -huh. and we're going to preview for next week um, with my John Byrne list um, because that's what we're going to play. And we're finally actually going to win a league next week, which is going to be yeah, fucking our first. God. It's going to be our first time that we win a league next week. Yeah. All right, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to switch with you yeah. and let you get in here. Yep. We're going to switch over, so... And then you you talk to the people yeah, because I'm gonna I'm gonna focus to make it fast. And yeah. I'm gonna, here's the commentator cam. You can tell okay. about all kinds of stuff here. Yeah. So wow, this seat is really fucking warm. Yeah. What the yeah, hell, I man? Had, I just literally shit my pants. Oh, I wore, a, I wore a diaper today because I didn't know how much streaming we were gonna be doing. You are a disgusting monster. I uh, yeah, I did. I wore a diaper. Uh, what you want from me? He's not wearing a diaper. Does it smell weird in here? No, you're just weird in here. Okay. You're, you're the All weirdest right, so, thing about being uh, in here. Yeah, so I'm gonna I'm gonna tell the people what happens uh, tonight again, and tell them what time and all that jazz. Yeah, and... so uh, if you're if you're not able to make the the one thirty start time for Magic After Dark, um, come check us out on uh, on the YouTube page, um, and then you will see if you did join our YouTube page and you followed us, our channel, then um, you'll be able to see at a later date whenever you look at it, if you want or not. And, uh, Do you know what a coaster is? Look at I this. I don't know what a coaster Look is. Look at what you did. So, yeah. Blue, white, blue balls today. Yeah, blue no. fucking balls So, Icy today. asked if we were actually trying to be competitive. No, that was our that was our fun one. Uh, I, yeah. But it just really sucked because we didn't get to show off anything that the deck really got to do because we didn't play against creature decks. We played against three Jeskai fucking decks. So, like, okay, I think... So, Icy, here, here's what would have happened. Um, we could have, we could have made the mana base.
a little bit better. Mm -hmm. uh, we could have took a little bit more time upgrading the deck. We didn't because we want to, again, we want to focus on maybe some casual aspects of the game. Oh, uh, every other week, we're, get, we're doing um, one casual list. And then the following week, we're doing a competitive list. Right. Uh, so if we make it too... One day we'll be separate we up, all of Yeah, if we upgrade it too much into a competitive list, um, then it, it kind of takes away from the casual aspect, and that's what we're trying to do here. Um, I think this could be a fine F and M, but like yeah. you said, you gotta have a creature heavy meta. You do. You gotta have a you. You need to see affinity. You need to see burn. You need to see uh, the hardened scales list, and you need to hit your ley lines. And you need to know how to play it, which yes. you did. I did not. Yeah, and so um, you just this is this is a really a meta dependent deck, um, but you can upgrade this thing, and you can make it good. Um, but you have to you have to make it your baby. You have to take time to, to love on it a little bit, and um, you know that's just not something that we 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 did. We didn't put any love into it. We just kind of gave the people. Um, you know, we said, "Hey, give us some ideas," and they they did. We got some ideas from. We the got group. some decent ones too. Yeah, from our local guys, um, and they said, you know, "Hey, change you know play this, change this in the sideboard." Not all of them are local. It's just the because we put them in your, in your Facebook group. Yes. In the yeah. Exactly. Group. Yeah. So we post the list in our group, and uh, of, usually on Monday, and we let people say, "Hey, this card's dog shit. This card's <laughs> good. Uh, maybe you should run." Like we had somebody say, "Maybe you should run Jace the Mind Sculptor." They're yeah. right. They're absolutely right. We should have had a couple. At what least... about its fairy? <laughs> yeah. Sure. More lands. But you, Jace is probably better in this because need the staff to resolve. <laughs> You're such a That's what he kid. fucking said. Who? Icy. That's what Icy said. Yeah, I know we need a staff to resolve. I know this. It's, it's never going to resolve, though. Sad. But yeah, um, again, it's great. It's a great deck, uh, but it's meta-dependent. So you definitely want to Moto is bugging tweak out. this thing. I hate Moto sometimes. It's bugging. It's tripping. Um, let's see if we can pull up the deck here that you want. Is it called Black Lightning? Yeah. Is there any changes that you need to make to it? No. Nope. You sure? Yeah. What about all the new Core 19 cards? No. All right, so um, I'll go into telling you guys about Black Lightning. Well, they can't see it. Yeah, no, I'm going to tell them about it. Okay. They don't need to see it. They don't need to see it. I'm going to paint a motherfucking picture. <laughs> Holy fuck. So, um, I came up with this deck um, on my own. He did. He um, did. This deck's gorgeous. It, it'll see. It, it'll. It'll see some play eventually one day. Uh, I'm just trying to find some pros to play it. I know. I'll, I'll know. I'll be able to do it. I'm gonna start sending people lists eventually when I get real passionate about it. We could get Jim Davis to play it. He takes those kind of like donations. I'll play your deck kind of thing. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, well. But you're going to have to tell... I don't know if you can send him, like, a, a play guide. Because you're going to have to say, like, listen, always go for the crypt, uh, Blood Crypt on turn yeah, one. Yeah, I can... I mean, I can give him a play guide and just give him kind of, like, a, a brief summary of, like, what you need to do. I don't know where any of us are going to find time for that. <laughs> yeah, we don't have enough to do in our lives. Right? Um, so, I, I built this deck. Um, it I played red-white uh, for about three years. And so I stopped playing when I started um, when I started floor trading and started my business. Uh, I stopped playing almost completely, and then uh, I picked modern back up um, about a year and a half into um, starting my business. So I wanted to uh, I just wanted to play again. I was just really uh, you know being around the game was it was just killing me. I got the itch back. Um, so I. I was uh, I started playing here at Pandemonium Games in Garden City, um, and that's where Chris works. For those of you that don't know, it's basically where I live. And yeah, where Chris lives. Um, and so I started playing uh, every Wednesday. So I would do you know I'd do some training and then I'd play. Um, and I was getting my fucking ass handed to me every single week, and I was just like, man, I know I stopped playing for a little while, and I know I wasn't that great, but. When I shouldn't, a good like, day. Yeah, like, usually, I'm like a three, I'm like a, I'm an F&M all-star, pretty much. 
I I'm like a, that. That's a good word. You know, I am no, I'm no more than an F and M All Star. Um, and so I was playing the red white version again with the splash of green for the sideboard, and <clears throat> my my opponents would be at like, you know, four or five, and I was just like, God damn it, what am I doing wrong? You're and playing so, three colors. Don't play three colors. No, just, just you shut don't. your mouth. So, don't do it. um, so I, I I thought to myself like I have to be faster. I have to go Cut fast. Um, and so that's when I started looking at. Um, playing Bump in the Night. And then I found the new card that came out called Gonti's Machinations. Mm -hmm. um, so I, I saw that I was able to progress my board state on one, so it was like a sub-lightning helix. You can't target your opponent, uh, your opponent's creatures with it, um, and you also need energy to activate it, but it's still it's fine. It's so easy to get the energy. Yeah, it's really, it's too easy to get the energy. Um, and so a lot of people, um, I've been in, I've been down some burn, um, um, Reddit K holes, okay? K hole? Uh, yeah, like when you when you get trapped in Reddit and you're just down in like a K hole. Okay. On Reddit. Oh, K hole is. Yeah. But I understand what you're saying. Yeah. Um. So, I I read a bunch on Gonti's machinations and everybody said this card is fucking awful. Yeah. It's awful, 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 awful. I think they're wrong too, now, Josh. I think if you're you, right. if they're like if you ever top deck it, it's no good. And, but that's not that's wrong because that's also, yeah. you have to stack your energy correctly. And if you're not playing it correctly to start with, then yeah, it is dog shit. You're never gonna you're never gonna be able to have energy when you top deck it. So Jesus you just will answer your question. Yeah, yeah, you just hold you just hold the line with Gontis. And so um, I just found that bump in the night was really good. And then this opens you up if you're playing uh, Jund, This opens you up to um, quicker turn three kills if you go. Um, like Swift Spear, Swift Spear, or Goblin Guide, Goblin Guide into um, like Bolt, uh, Atarka's Command. Atarka's Command. So uh, playing Atarka's Command in the main also helps the turn three kill, and then you can also you're running extra copies of Shard Volley. So that's so you're dropping all the two drops. God, I uh, hate four Mono. one drops. So that's really the key to this. And then of course, like you get some really cool shit in the sideboard with Black. Um, you that. lose Path to Exile, um, but you gain Fatal Push. Now, Path to Exile is better than Fatal Push, I will admit. I've even talked wait, to wait. some local guys. Fatal, wait, which one's better? Path to Exile is okay. better than Fatal Push, and it's... it's, it's just, it does get more things. Well, it just, it, yeah, it, it's just better. Um, but you get things like Rakdos Charm, um, you know, and that doubles as Graveyard Hate, and it also doubles as a Creature Overload... Um, sort of price of progress ask kind of card in modern. So um, when like let's say humans uh, overloads the board or affinity overloads the board, uh, you can have all their creatures do one damage to them. So usually it'll hit for like at at minimum it hits for three usually. So it's still a lightning bolt. Um, but Fine. most of the time it's a Boros charm. It hits for four. Um, and then you also um, which I didn't think this was real. Um, because I had a couple extra spots in the sideboard, and I thought to myself, man, like, sometimes combo can just murder me. You know, combo can just take me out of the game. Um, and I thought, well, how do I alleviate that? Um, and I thought, okay, do I put more graveyard hate in there um, for things like um, um, dredge or things like, um, what's the other combo deck? Uh, hmm? Dredge what? Uh, the, uh, grape Storm? Shot. Storm, yeah. So I'm like, okay, maybe I need more graveyard hate. Well, uh... It just it, it wasn't fitting in the deck well, and so uh, I put Thought Seizes in the sideboard, and so Thought Seize has been an actual fucking house. Uh, I never thought I'd play Burn and pl be able to play Thought Seize, um, but I bring it in all the time. Um, it's it's really good against a lot of decks. Um, going turn one Thought Thought Seize is is just a play. It's just real good. Um, so that's another neat aspect of the deck, uh, and I feel like it's correct. I haven't I haven't had it to where I'm like, oh, okay, this I, I brought in Thought Seize and it was bad. It's always been good. Um, so yeah, that's that's pretty much the deck. It's just Bump in the Night, Gonti's Machinations for uh, the main board Black Sources. Icy Fire, or Icy Fire wants to know what the uh, jankiest deck you've ever run is. Oh, uh, the jankiest deck that I have ever run. Hmm. God, what's the jankiest deck I've ever run? 
Hey, there's there's quite a few options. Is that what yeah, you're thinking no, through? I don't know. I always think I'm being competitive. Um. So my jankiest deck is probably the tutelage standard deck, but I don't okay. think it was. I think it was blue black. I don't think it was blue red. It had more spot removal stuff as opposed to like the anger sweepers. Okay. Um, I don't know. I played. I always try to play competitive decks, so I think the jankiest deck I've ever run is probably the deck that I played in um, Modern. When Modern first started, I played a smallpox list that was, uh, <laughs> back then it was called Italian. Because what? It was, yeah. That's uh, racist. It is. I guess it is, but I mean, so it was, uh, it was Italian pox, and uh, it was red, white, and black. Um. And so now they call it what's red, white, black now? Mardu. Mardu. Yeah. So they 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 changed it to Mardu, but um, it played like a Johnny Italian Vengeance. Italian flag doesn't even um, have like what the hell? I don't fucking know. Don't ask me. Oh, Bobble Bobble Glen Guide? What the fuck? Boblin Guide, Boblo Island. Oh. Uh, this yeah. Was... So I'd say I'd say uh, I played Mardu Pox, and you could actually still play that in modern, and it's probably decent. Um, but it was it was pretty bad then because, like, you'd play the the legendary rule with flagstones trickier, so that was cute. But it was very difficult to get the double black source, and then it was like a pox walkers list. It's kind of shitty. Almost there, almost there. Do I get the idolons? Yeah, we almost we almost ready to play some bumpy. Fucking moto. Why why is this? software is so fucking laggy and buggy i hate it so much Ooh, the other card i want to tell you guys about in uh in this list is right, uh it. exquisite firecraft that card has been a fucking house as of late because as you saw in the last mat in the last five matches we uh played against three just guy players so uh exquisite firecraft has really really been a house all right, you ready to make somebody cry? This is this is the key card of the deck, which I'm not going to reload all the arts because yeah. fuck Moto. Uh, whenever you lose life, yeah, for whenever you time. lose life for the first time each turn, you get an energy. Pay two energy, sacrifice the machinations. Mm -hmm. Each opponent loses three, you gain three. Yep. Or you gain life equal to the life lost, lost this way. way. Yep. So it could hit like multiplayer or some shit like mm -hmm. that. Well, it gets well, around lay, uh, main board ley lines. Right, because it doesn't against, target. Yeah, when you're playing against uh, uh, Boggles. Mm -hmm. So a lot of Boggle players mm -hmm. are like, Oh man, I can't believe I lost to your deck. I have a great fucking matchup against Burn, and I'm like, well, uh, this isn't your regular Burn. Like Gonti's Machinations doesn't target; it hits opponents. A Tarkus Command does not target; it hits opponents. So I have a lot of outs against uh, Leyline. When people bring bring Leylines in, I just giggle. I don't give a fuck about Leyline. All right, just swap me. All right. How many people hate my Black Lightning? Uh, oh, look at. You hey, know, some people don't always hate the Black Lightning. Ask Terrence Vincent. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Add spreading seas. Hey, yeah. add some more spreading seas and my Black Lightning. Would you like to mulligan? I would love to mulligan this. God, I hate that it's not going to load the arts. That's going to tilt mm, me. I'm going to keep the shit out of this. Yeah, that's fine. You can keep that too, right? Yes, sir. Okay, I got to learn this. Yeah. So, are we on the play or are we on the draw? Roll the five. We're on the we're on the draw, so this is good. Hit okay. Oh, turn the upkeep on or the, the stop on his upkeep off. That's what it was. Stop on upkeep. Yeah, there. Oh, got it. Yeah. Okay, he did nothing. This is good. Mm. This is good. So from what I've learned from watching you play this deck is that you want to use your off fetches, use them, go get a blood crit, take three, and then play a goblin guy. Every yeah, time. so yeah, so our our uh, our resources in this deck is our life, because we're just trying to go faster than the than our opponent. This this deck should be called uh, Sonic minus Blue. <laughs> Sonic Boom. Sonic Boom. <laughs> black Black Sonic Lightning. We we're playing the Goblin Guide, yo. With yo. No picture. You're in begin combat. Yeah. My box. Wait, slow down. I'm slowing down. Okay. Because, like, I don't think it was a... Was that a stop in our upkeep? I don't know. Yeah, that was that was our stop. All right, you attacked. You good. Let's see. What's he going to reveal? He reveals a path to exile. Nice. 
Probably want to draw that against us, dude. So, can you... We're going to do this next week for sure, but can you explain why Atarkas command so he fetched away the uh, Path Exile? Ooh, baby. So he's Absan? Yep, he's Absan. So we... This is going to be a tough matchup. How good is Atarkas command? Atarkas command is a fucking house. How much better is Atarkas command than Boros Charm? So Boros Charm... Um, it gets the extra one damage in, so it effectively works as a Boros Charm. So we're going to hit for six here. You're not going to crack that yet, right? You're going to play... Wait. You're not... Oh, it's a bump in the night. I thought that was a Gonti's Machination. No. This is going to fucking throw me off, because these yeah. images won't load That's okay. until you reset Moto. So we're going to move to combat. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, and then we're going to attack. Could have a push. Begin combat. Attack. I'm so scared. It okay. So I want to pass priority back to him. So Fatal, Fatal Push is on top of his library. Okay. So if you're so going to... Yeah, before damage. Yeah. I'm going to crack this. I'm going to go get a green source. Even and then if, I'm going to cast a Tarkus Command. Yeah, and even if he uh, if he has a push here, this is the only opportunity that you would want to go for these Tarkus Commands anyways, because he's about to draw a push. Yep. So we have to play around that he doesn't have the other three or whatever. I don't Red, think they were on three. Green. Black. Red. Red. Don't you want me Your opponents baby? can't gain life, uh, so oh God, I want to do. Annoying. I don't. I want to click on. How do I? Well, uh, I want to click on. on both. You no. You want target's command deals three damage to each opponent. Creature you control get plus one plus one and gain reach taunt of turn. Nice. Okay. I thought they changed that. Yeah, because so I, I thought it was it just before. like it shows the four options and you and you click on I which two you too, want. But then they they put it together. Well, that that resolves. Let's see if he lets us hit with this now too. You can just F6 from here, Josh. Okay. Because, like, even if you didn't have removal, because there was, like, nothing else you were going to do. So if we draw a land here, and he fetch shocks, uh, then we... He's dead, right? Yeah, he dies. Yeah. So that's why, that's why I, like, I love a Tarkus command in this build, um, because you're going to hit... Usually, like, if anybody's fetching and shocking, usually they're dead. So, like, he's, he's going to go to 10... Um, this is moto bugging now because those two lands are not supposed to be on top of each other. This is literally that just moto lagging, bug. just moto lag. Yeah, see the time stopped on both. Yeah, yeah. So uh, I guess we, I can explain this. So when we get playback, it'll be on our turn. Like let's say, let's say he just like gains some life here. Um, so we're still and we draw our land. We're still gonna hit for nine. And then the following turn, he's going to, most he can be at, it was he's going to be at three, um, and then we're going to have enough to kill him with the Tarkos command. And we still have a draw. Click on uh, commentator's cam over here, Josh. Where? Over here. Commentator's cam? Yep. And then we're going to minimize Moto, if we can. We're just bugging out. Yeah, it's just Moto. Fucking Moto. Okay, we'll just leave it. Let's let it bug out for a minute, and then we'll see if it comes back. Because, I mean, I'm, I'm sure it's happening on his end also, right? No. It's not? It's, not. it's just bugging out. Go back to end. MGGO, man. Maybe? It's not necessarily doing it on his end. Yeah. It's just us, because our time's not moving, his time's not moving. Um, we had F6 through his turn, so whatever he did, he did. And now when we get it back, it's going to be on our turn. Go wait for program to respond. Just Moto. Moto's bugging, tripping, yo. Moto's just eating all of our time. Yeah, so it knows that, uh... Let me explain a Tarkus command a little bit oh, better, please. too, because you asked. Yeah, tell me why it's better than uh, Boros Crown. Okay. Uh, so it's better than Boros Charm because it's more aggressive in, I guess, pretty much every fashion so far that I've seen. Um, it allows you, in the Humans matchup, it actually uh, it acts as a uh, board wipe. So you're going to buff all your dudes, um, and you're also going to give them reach. So you're going to be able to kill 
uh, kite sail freebooter, and you're gonna be able to get your get your uh, whatever What's they the took from you too? back. The manus rider. Yeah, in manus rider. So it's really good. Yeah, so your goblin guide can uh, effectively trade um, with a uh, uh, manus me, rider. Yeah. I'm gonna try and reset try all of this. Okay. I'm gonna try and do it quickly. Yeah. Um. So I like that. I like how it works against humans. You've definitely like. I, yeah, you I got to see watch. you do it. Yeah, you got to watch me. Because, like, I played against humans at the SCG in, in Kentucky. Kentucky. Um, Oops, my bad. So, um, and I, I didn't blow the guy out, but it was it was a close match. Did you blow a guy in Kentucky? I didn't, I, I didn't blow a guy. Listen, my wife be, might be watching this. <laughs> Hi, Julie. It's Julia. Damn it! <laughs> nice try, it's though. not Julia. I know it's not. Um, but, yeah, so um, I didn't blow the guy out, but I did... Um, you know, Atarka's command was definitely part of the reason why I won. Um, now, other people will say, well, uh, Boros Charm is good because it gives all your permanents indestructibility, so you could still block um, and you can still value out the indestructibility part and save your dudes and move to damage. Well, it doesn't plus your guys. It doesn't make your. It doesn't turn your. Um, it turns your Swift Spears into. Um, uh, let's see, three fours with reach. Along, Boros Charm does it also. Well, no, it doesn't because it doesn't buff them. Chat window bugged out now too. It's not displaying again. Man, we just we're just hitting a wall. We just hit the we we hit the wall. I don't know. I can't hey, get to work. there we go. We're back in. Well, we're kind of back in. I like it. So, I think we would have we would definitely won that game. That's for sure. Our hand was pretty nutty. Even if we don't draw a third no, land, no, no, there. we're not out of that game. Oh, we're not out of the game. No, we're just disconnected. So it'll it'll pull that game back up. At least it should pull that game Unless back up. Unless that guy just conceded and went to another game. Right. He it'll still pull it up and say you win, and then it'll be like, well, fuck, that was worth less. Yeah. I feel like we're sticking around too, and I don't know why. We might be lagging a little bit. Our connection's really good, though. Yeah. Connection's really good. CPU percentage is good. Yeah. I just hate Moto. Moto tilts me, mm -hmm. just in general. Yeah. Because it's such a buggy, crappy piece of software. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like, I put in our password and we're re-logging in yeah, 30 but, seconds ago. Yeah, I mean... And it, it's still trying to process. Is that the right password? Does that go with that account? Uh-huh. I don't know. Give me my water. Yeah. Spank you. Use the... Uh, give me my uh, Pepsi. Well... Wow, you drank everything, huh? Yeah. I'm a thirsty boy. You thirsty dog. Loading magic online. Yeah, my chat window bugged out again. Man, testicle, that once before. testicle difficulties, eh? <laughs> <laughs> this never happens to me, you're, I swear. You're so funny. It doesn't. It, this never happens. So only, only when I drink too much. Is there anything I can get rid of here? Nope, 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 nope. Man, I wanted you to be able to show off this deck. We, uh, if the guy scooped, then we just play another round. But I mean, we, might we have. literally, I like, like, we it should have popped back up by now. I, I think. only need about eight minutes. Not only in moto, but need about eight minutes. Making a cake. <laughs> to make a cake. <laughs> Right? Yeah, I can bake a cake. And what? Eight no. minute cakes. How long does with it take? Josh Warren? How long does it take for water to boil? Eleven minutes? No, it doesn't take that long. You put a little salt in there. Mm, no, how much? How wrong. much water are you boiling? And how shitty is your stove? <laughs> I got me an electric stove that don't work too well. <laughs> I, I forgot in, to plug it in. I live in a rural development area. I need to reset your router. <laughs> I don't know why. Look at it. It just does nothing. <laughs> I hate, Don't you rage, all right? I we hate got Moto. this. We got this. Boy, she'll cheer you up. We're literally oh, doing. Here she comes. We're literally doing nothing else. It's like OBS is using like thirty percent. Oh, Moto's taking the other billion. Hey, there we are. Yeah, but we still don't have that match. That's all right. We're gonna go to a different match. What the heck is it modern? Mo modern. That don't click on burn. Gaunty. Yeah, Gonti burn. There you go. That's how I feel, Rush. How I feel. Yeah, I know. Face palm. Rosh, what did you do uh, at nationals? What did you play? Did you play the main event? Did you play side events? He played the main event. He played main. Yeah, he's. I mean, he ain't no scrub. He made it. <laughs> he ain't no scrub. What did you play? 
I I played um, side events and lost all my side events. Yeah. I think that guy scooped. It's so sad. That's all right. We'll just beat somebody else's face in. Let's try. Oh hey, I hope to God we get to play against Jessica. I'll, I'll show you. I'll show you how good of a fucking game that is. I don't want to play against Jessica just because oh, I don't want to see their stupid I, freaking. I want to punish Jessica. This list is so What's good against Jessica. Sorry, you can't join because you're blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I know. I'm... What? Submit this dick. <sighs> okay. Maybe our other game is still going? I don't know. I don't know. Let's try it again. Imported deck. No, 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 no. We're already there. We're in construct play tournament. Host, host a new match now. We don't want to do Whatever, that. Whatever, it doesn't matter. Maybe that guy's... I hope that guy's not still waiting for us. He probably is, and now I feel real bad. <laughs> I hate that. Okay. Oh, here she comes. Uh, he said no main, did five qualifiers, so got my four promos. Oh, nice. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's okay, right, because okay. we got to talk about uh, got that to attack that kind of blew up in with, their face. Got to attack with seven horses and, a, and trample a guy to death. <laughs> the, I hope that they were shiny horses. Yeah. Um... Okay, so what are we doing? Uh, we can do better. Mulligan? Yeah, Mulligan. Okay. You want to swap? Yeah. Okay. Um, Mulligan. Mulligan. Keep. Keep. Rift Bolt. No. Pass it. Bottom. All right, cool. All right, Moto. We are back, y'all. Don't fuck us this time. Look, I got my dream. Oh, my God. I got my dream. Is he gonna see our visions? No, it's wizard. <laughs> it's... <laughs> We're gonna lose. We're gonna play and lose to wizards. Oh, that's so funny. Why are you saying we're gonna lose to wizards? Because bitch? that's our luck, man. <laughs> we're not gonna lose to wizards. You're never gonna see another land. It's gonna be great. <laughs> uh. Spear, right? You just go. Um... Now ask me, ask me why I'm gonna go get my black source. Why are you gonna go get your blood crypt? Because when you uh, have an Atarkus community. Because what, these, what's the idea? Because these Gantis, if I draw Gantis machinations and yes. I lock myself out of that, I'm locking myself out of life gain. I agree. So that's agree. why I'm gonna go get a blood crypt. You 100% get the blood crypt. So I don't care about this card right now because hopefully I can draw into another land. Yes. Yes. Okay. Um. So right here, uh, what would you do, Christopher? Would uh, you play a Swift Spear or Rift Bolt here? Ooh. That's a good question. Um, I want to play the Swift Spear just because the next turn I'll play the Rift Bolt, or maybe I draw another land, play the other Swift Spear, and then suspend the Rift Bolt, and then get double prowess on the following turn. <gasps> I did it wrong. You did it wrong. I did it wrong. So what okay, are you so behind? hold on. What does Rash say? Uh, I played a trolley of standard vampire and crested sunmare tokens, and yes, foily. Very nice. Very nice, sir. Beat him with horses. Horse travel. Beat him to death with horses, baby. Beat you with this horse dick. Ugh. All right. There was another one. You got sweepers in this deck? No, but spot removal is it's, our sweepers. This is straight up wizards, man. This is kill fiend wizards. <laughs> Wizard? Wizard? Yeah, Wizard Harry. Our sweepers are just gonna get shot, right? Is that how this yeah. is gonna work? Yeah. Yeah. So like we, we're just gonna play. We're just gonna play like uh from from our back foot until we can kind of slow them down. What do we mull to? Four? We mull to five. Mull to five. Yeah. We want to cast our Rift Bolt. We want to target... Uh, no. It, you just, just hit okay. We just do like this. Okay. Click away from that. Just hit okay. And then it'll say, do you want to cast this? You say, yeah, I want to cast it. What are you talking about? Yeah, I want to cast it. No, no, this. click it. What? I think you have to click it now. I'm not sure. Now I'm not sure. Click it. Okay. Just yep. hit okay. Yeah, no, hit okay. Hit okay. I don't know. I don't know. I just, that shell dock aisle was crap, okay? All it's right. got me terrified of how to cast these things. Okay. Fucking rift bolt this guy. I want to Rift Bolt so close card. Cast Rift Bolt. Click, Click the, the, card. the card. Cast it. No, that's the trigger. You need the cards. The other thing. Oh, 
this thing. That thing. That's my target. Holy Slow shit. Slow him down. Oh, wow. That was tough. Okay. Now you just skip through your main phase. Did I? Yep. No. Yes. I did? Yes. Jeez. We're just gonna five just to be safe here. Okay. Be in combat. I don't want it doesn't matter, I don't want to attack anyways. That's fine. Make these creatures. Yep. It's still being like laggy. That's why you're getting these weird timing issues. Alright, so I'm gonna play both Swift Spears here and I'm just gonna pass the turn. I don't think it took the click on the Swift Spear. Moto's being really shit. Okay, F6. Let's not F6. Let's Please. just fucking. He keeps taking priority and it's throwing us off. Yeah, so we're not even going to block here. We're just going to take it all to the face because next turn we're going to yeah, try to attack Darkest Command. We're racing, right? No, we're playing defense. We're actually. playing defense. Yeah, we are. So, like. So, you're going to block next use, turn? Yeah, then so, next turn, command? Yeah, so uh. the next turn we're going to block and then we're going to use the Tarkus Command again as a board wipe. Okay. So, you asked me, do we have board wipes in here? Yeah, we do. It's a Tarkus Command. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, our creatures are going to become three, three fours. fours? Three fours, yeah. Okay. They're going to get in there. But we're going to take a lot of fucking damage right now, probably. But, whatever. I don't know, I think he's only going to attack with the one Soul Scar Mage. <laughs> oh. Wizard. Wizard Lightning. Oh, he's blasting one of our dudes. He's smart. Oh, he just thinks you're going to block, maybe. I don't know. Bad luck. Get it, Tay-Tay. You're, like, taking it to the face, huh? <laughs> I love taking it to the face. <laughs> Who that is? Icy Fire's always... He's always That's getting icy me. fire. He's a, he's always got that cool burn. He does. He's always got that sick burn getting me. What do we want to draw? What are we gonna draw? We drew a Tarkus command. We drew an Tarkus. We did draw an Tarkus yeah, command. So we're just gonna pass. Three damage target. We don't want to. Oh, it no, makes sense. We don't we're gonna land. die. Yeah, we didn't hit our land. Yeah, we mulled a five. Like we're just behind. So we get to be on the play next game, which I'm really excited about. Yeah. But then the third game. <laughs> Haste. Uh, He's got haste. It's uh, what do you call him? He's got it's down. Oh. It's the Down Syndrome oh. Goblin Guide. Yeah, this is Down Syndrome Goblin Guide. <laughs> so fucked up. That's great. Attack. Yeah. All right, eat, eat a guy. Yeah. Oh Can't shit. Block that guy. Block one of the other dudes. Cool. No, I'm gonna cast a Tarkus command and kill this thing. How are you gonna attack it? Oh, how? Oh, because you're gonna give it a reach? Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, you silly dog. Wow. Good play, dude. Alright, select the right options. Plus one, plus one, and. Reach. Uh, no, so three damage. Yep. Yeah, three damage. This is it, right? Yeah, that's it. That's right. That right. You ever seen a Swift Spear jump in the air? <laughs> you, ever, you ever see a Swift Spear get hover? Here it is. We got Tay Tay on board. We got Tay Tay on, on blast. And we got Tay Tay in the air. Resolve your spell, Josh. Burns are appropriate since that's what you were trying to play. Yeah, you're right. Resolve that spell. I did. Oh, there's triggers on the stack. It shows you the stack. Oh. Maybe loss of life and reach because prowess triggers. You gotta get into the block step. Got it. You gotta practice for next week. You've got I to. I will. Because I don't know how to play your deck. Okay. Take four. We die. <laughs> yeah, take four. Get punished. Oh, thank you. Alright, you got a bolt. So you gotta block 
Bolts. God, if we drew a land there, a if, we, if we drew a land there and had a, a yeah, a it would be God, we would have been in. We've been in good. So spot. do you just lava spike and hold the bolt and stay back? Mm, no, we're just gonna die here. But like our our like the optimal play right now is just uh, move to combat. Like when he moves to combat, we're just gonna bolt here. Uh, actually, no, You're I think we just bolt here now. Turn, yeah. yeah, we just bolt here now. So, now? Wait, why now? Uh, because it doesn't matter. He's not going to be able to get... He doesn't have Gytaxian Probe. Yeah, but we're going to lose our Swift Spear. Because we're not going to have Prowess. It's, he's going to attack with Tutus. Yeah, but we don't want him to have mana up so that he, he gets his Prowess triggers. And then he makes another Tutu? Yeah. He makes another Tay Tay. Trust me, we just, we just bolt here. I trust you. We just main phase bolt. You ever main phase bolted before? No. Not many people have. It no. feels. It feels sometimes. It feels real good. So then we're gonna uh, we're gonna lava spike here because okay. You know. Well then, then you're yeah. Man. That's fine. Click him. Click him. No, you click. Click him. Mm, I thought it had to shoot up first. We so dead, doggy. See, here, I was like, even if he has a card that he can play. <laughs> Let's wrap up the top ropes. What a sicko. He didn't even sculpt that either. Yeah, we'll take five. Yeah, we'll take five. I hate miracles so much. We'll take five. I hate miracles. Five damage. Begin sideboarding. All right. Sideboarding. We're going to get up in those ass cheeks, bub. We're going to get them. All right, what do you bring? All right, so uh, we're going to be on the play. Uh, so we want to bring our extra copy of Searing Blood in. Um, Push. We are also going to bring in our... Th no, no, we don't want our Thought Seizes. We just want our Lava Mancer. Because he's going to do a lot of fucking work. Um, and we could... We could play the the waiting game, but we don't want to with Rakdos Charm. I think he's only ever gonna and have two to three creatures him, on board. Yeah, so mm -hmm. it's really it's fine. Uh, and uh, we can we can bring in push. Push is good here. Okay. Because we want to push those little them little bastards. So four uh, cards. So the worst card in the deck here is is Rift Bolt. Um, this is the slowest card. Um, and so we brought three in. Mm, yep. No, you brought four in. I you brought, brought in two in. pushes, the Lava Mancer, and you brought in the Searing Blood. Oh, the Searing Blood. Yeah, okay. So we're still on the play, so we want to keep Eidolons in. So um, we're just going to take a... Um, Do you want a Shard Volley or so we're gonna take a, a one of So we're going to take a one of Bump out just in case okay. this guy is special and, and he brings in um, Blood Moons. Okay. So you always have to think about Blood Moon because... But he could also bring in um, like a bridge, right? But we have plenty of burn. Uh, he's not going to... He could bring bridges in, but we don't... We want him to play a bridge. Because we're the burn deck. He's not. Okay. He, yeah, we want to burn his face off. Hell yeah, we want to play first. Oh, baby. Oh, okay. this is what dreams are made out All of. All right, you got to show me. Because I look at this and I'm just like, I don't I don't know what to do. Uh, this is it's what... like play a Gonti, play a Gonti, pray? I don't know. No. It's play this... a Gonti, play a Gonti, play Eidolon. Fucking win. Mm. I missed that part. You're right. Don't hit you. <laughs> okay, so you're going to play the Gonti on this turn, and then next turn you're going to play the other Gonti and then fetch, right? No, actually I think I'm just going to play, because um, we're going to get energy because we have the Eidolon, so we're going to go turn two Gonti. Or turn, turn two, two Eidolon. Eidolon. Yeah. We're not going to play the other Gonti? Okay. No. Okay like that i i i see where you, what you're doing yeah because we're gonna be able to stack off energy every time we cast something we're just yeah. gonna be double energy every single time thanks yep so those of you watching you'll be able to uh see how this card actually works properly and uh you won't have to read how bad it is on reddit you'll get to see hey, the how first, good it is the first time it pops up um just always yield Oh, the Gantis? Yeah. You got it. Alright, so... 
we want to go we got to make sure that we play our land correctly here so we're going to save ourselves some life um by we're going to save ourselves one point of damage by playing a stomping grounds here okay untapped sure sure because later we just use the pills to get a base to get a basic uh basic because we have all Correct. the colors yes okay you auto yield to that always yield yep the night alarm. So did we get our energy? We we did get an energy. Where's it at? Right it's here? right over here. It's, Ooh, it? yeah, yeah, sweet. Okay. Red, red, Eidolon, Dizzle. Thank you. You're welcome. I, the thing I do like about this is that you can you can't miss your Eidolon triggers. <laughs> Can't be bad. Trigger. Okay. Okay. So sad. This guy's gonna be real sad when we play our second copy of fucking Gonti's Machinations. It's gonna be a sad pupper. Man, yeah, we don't think the attack is gonna increase you this time, though. Yeah, we'll draw one. Have faith. Have, have faith. Right. There we go. We got two energy, baby. And then we drew the bump in the night. God, what a fucking monstrosity of a hand. Alright, so first things first, we're going to play out Dizganti. Mm -hmm. um, so this is actually, this is where a lot of times that I run into the issue with double black. So here we can't actually do the double black. Because we don't want to lose that much life. Because even though we're going to be, be gaining six eventually, soon, very right. soon... We still are gonna have to probably take a lot of damage before we So he's kill. at he's at sixteen, this is six, so he's at ten, yeah. this is seven, that makes it five, four, that makes it he's at one. Yeah, so actually what we're gonna do is we're gonna pass turn. And then and then we're gonna bolt we're gonna something. bolt well we're gonna bolt him. Uh Hopefully. actually we should probably bolt his creature. Okay. Well then he's at a little higher life. Yeah, I like bolting his creature here. Could get free energy for later machinations. Well, I could I could actually crack and get double energy here. Yeah. With the red source. Um, what do I want to do here? I don't know. So you, this, that's why you yeah, have to run my, this one. Yeah, this I don't know. My, uh, my line is uh, pass. My line is pass. Okay. Yeah. Go what you got. Yeah, my line pass. Are you fetching on his own stuff? No. Okay. You're not fetching it since then. No. Okay. Because I want to save it for searing in case we top deck searing blaze. Got it. Um, because that one has landfall. Yep. Okay. Searing searing blood's the other one. Searing blood is two red, um, and then two two damage, and then, uh, two damage to a creature, and then three damage when it hits the graveyard. Okay. <laughs> Ugh, this is a dangerous spot to bolt, right? Well, we, we can we can bolt in response to the prowess triggers. There you go. Okay, I didn't think he was going to bolt there. I thought he would just attack. So now you can bolt kill the storm chaser? Yeah. And then are you going to do anything else on his turn? No. So we just want to gain our triggers from this attack. Yep. And then we're we're up six points of life. Yeah, I didn't think that he would bolt before attacking there. I thought he would just swing for two. And if we tried to removal, then he would bolt us. Oh yeah, the bolt. We already got our triggers off the bolt. So now we're. Oh yeah, we don't get more life. It's only once per turn. Ooh, so we drew another lightning bolt. Beautiful. So we got so... three, six, nine, twelve. 15 damage here okay we're one short yeah so we're one short so um the way we want to play this is um we want to go ahead and we want to crack one of the gontis sure uh now you don't want to do it uh after he hits you this upcoming turn actually you know what i want to crack this okay and get more energy i want to get double energy um you don't have your searing blaze thing then yeah then then i missed out on searing blaze so that could be it could be an issue so um, I, I'm tired of playing the control game. I think I just want to top deck here. Are we definitely bumping in the night here? In the, uh, this turn? Oh, I see the line now. Okay, so okay. yeah, so we crack both of these. Oh, God. 
Yeah, we need to get energy first. I don't okay. know what's going on. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm just... It's, it's difficult for me to explain this. While still playing it. So I'm gonna get my red source here. Yeah, I'm gonna get my red source here. Why is this... Oh, he's just Because yielding. he's got the priority and it just takes forever. Got it. Moto is a pain in the ass. Come on, Moto. We want to show these motherfuckers how Gonti lit. You want to get a Johnny Montana? You got a Montana. All right. So then we are going to sacrifice. Snackrifice. Yep. Pay two energy. Seems good. Snackrifice. Pay two energy. So now no, we have enough we have, for one yes, more. Yes, we have enough for one more. So that's why this this card does not suck balls. Bump him. Uh, yeah, so we're going to bump, and then we are going to... Can he do 12 points of damage next turn? No. Sure about that? Yeah, he can do uh, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. His maximum next turn is 10. Okay. All right, so then we're going to pass turn. Yeah. Because we can do everything on, on his turn. Yep. And if we need to, we can have this bolt up so that we can stop him from killing us in case some shenanigans. So it's like... Land, wizards, lightning, wizards, lightning, wizards, lightning. He's casting something. Okay, yeah. So we're out. We're out of it. The the thick of things here. So that's seven. Do you have to kill a creature here? No. So he's gonna. If he goes like lightning bolt, then we take three, four, five, six, seven. We take seven total. Okay. So we're hoping that we top deck here. Because you're gonna target command. I'm gonna target command. Yeah. Actually, you know, I'm gonna lightning bolt because if we draw a creature, a creature, yeah, if we draw a creature, we want to have that. It's four damage, yeah. right? So we'll miss out on that extra point. Well, well, yeah, yeah. It's just small intricacies. It's nothing. It big. is. That's what makes it's it really so nothing tough. big. He spell pierced you. Nice. Okay. I'm okay with that. I hit six. I don't want to fucking no. Tell it no. Fuck you, Moto. <laughs> Tilting piece of shit. You get Moto. Uh, so we got six in hand, so we don't have enough to kill him here. Uh, he's got one card in hand, so he has a possibility of drawing, like, let's say he had draws two bolts. So that's three, six... Uh, seven, seven, eight, eight nine, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So he's got enough to kill us here. So we. But we have, have a shard volley, so you can interact yeah. with one of his creatures. Yeah. So we're gonna have to pass the turn and play defense. That spell pierce was good. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Thanks. Hit me. Hit me, baby, one more time. Hit me, baby, <laughs> one more time. Deadly crossbow. He is opting. Mm. Do you want to shoot something now? Uh, well, he could then, in response, he could pop it, so... So, if you if you shard volley the Soul Scarred Mage, mm -hmm. he would have to play two more spells, so he would have to play something that cantrips, and um, draws him another spell that he can play immediately. Yeah, so I think we're safe with, with shard volleying his dude. So you're going to go after the Soul Scarred Mage? Yeah. Okay. Sacrifice the Mountain... No, 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 no. You have to... What have just happened here? Deli's face here, cast instant. So click, click the shard volley. Click that guy. And then you have to select your mountain that you want to sacrifice. So we should have... If we were scared that he was going to have it, we should have done this during the upkeep. So we made a play mistake. Mm. Just saying. We were trying to. We were just hoping that he had land. I guess I don't know. Okay, so he is gonna cast something. Mm -hmm. Echoing truth. What is he targeting? He's targeting a soul scar mage. I don't think we care. Okay. That's a weird one to have in the main board. Or no, well on the sideboard. I guess maybe he was trying to hit. He didn't even see Gothis, did he? No, he was echoing truth to like save his creatures from your removal because he's on the uh, he's on the draw. He's on the draw, and he can use it to bounce your creatures as well. So we're we gonna target command him here. No, you can't. No, you have to. Oh, we're we need up. two spells now. Yeah, we do. We're behind. 
Eidolon's a good one. Because he has to recast something and then he immediately goes to five. Yeah, Eidolon's actually really good here. But if he hits us, let's say he goes... Yeah, he goes to five. We just got to make sure that we don't lock ourselves out of the game. Mm -hmm. So we have to do math. So uh, let's say he casts something, he goes to five. He casts something else, he goes to three. Uh, then he's going to hit us for a three in the air. Uh, so then... Uh, three, six. Yeah, we can lock ourselves out of the game very easily with Idol on here. Yeah, but I don't see what other play you have. Because if you get to Idol on here and he just deals some damage to himself and deals one or two to you, then on your next turn you can a target's command give your Idol on reach. Yeah, we don't have a choice. We have to play him. We're fucked. Oh baby. It's good to see a land hit. And we 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 might lose to we might get two owed by wizards. By right here. wizards, Harry. Harry wizards. Uh, okay. Whenever you cast an instant or sorcery spell, wizards, you can. Oh God. Why did he only attack with the one? Well, he's leaving it back so he doesn't die, so he doesn't attack and then bolt it and kill him. Yeah, but you bolt it, attack, right? So we don't have enough mana. Yep, so we're dead. Not necessarily. But you can't cast anything this turn. You have to you have to hold up the target's command so that you can block something. Get your idol on off the field and then lava spike him, because then he'll die. That's all you can do. Yep. You're right. Because he attacks with both creatures. Uh the does this thing also have prowess? How does this thing read? Oh, hey. Are can, you we trying... can we attack here? Yeah. So if and you... then kill his dude when he moves to blocks? Yeah, we can. And then we can get Eidolon off the field. Because if he doesn't block here, we kill him. He has to block. He has to block? Yeah. Okay. You're right, you're right, okay. Yeah. Because he has to block, but then does this creature die, or are you going to target yeah, command now? I'm going to target command now. Okay. We just got to hope that he whiffs. This is our only out. We know what's in his hand. It's the uh, Soul Scarred Mage. Oh, so if he, he plays Soul Scarred Mage, does it have haste? No. Oh, okay. So a target command is ass. Yeah. Green. And then you go to three, and we have to dodge one draw. Red. Yeah. Or you could let's see d -d -d three. No, this is right. Yeah, this is correct. Look at us playing good magic. I have no idea. I'm honestly trying to keep up with you on this one. This one's this one's really wonky to me. So all it's we have just to a chess do, game. all we have to do is dodge. A spell. Yeah, so like he, well, he can't play anything because Eidolon's still on the board. Oh, good call. Yeah, so, so that's he can why just hit us for two. Yeah, that's why we had now. To I get it. Now yeah. I get it. Okay. See, I'm got. I got to catch up to you each time. Okay, he dies. Cool. He was just showing us that he drew it. Okay. All right. Sideboard. Game All three. Right. So we're, we're on the game draw. Three. Yep. So we're on the draw. So we're gonna want to play. We're gonna want to kind of play a little bit. No. What's this, there, what are the options on Rakdos Charm? Uh, Rakdos Charm? Yeah, so we, we probably want to bring Rakdos Charm in Exile here. all cards from target player's graveyard. Destroy target artifact. Yeah, so we're going to... Destroy target artifacts. Yeah, it's not it's not very relevant. It, we want the damage to for creatures, right? Yeah. Yeah. Um, so we're going to take... Um, Curve's getting higher. Yeah. We're going to get Eidolons out of there. It's okay that our curve gets higher. Because we're playing kind of defensively. Uh, wait. What are you? What are you doing now? Um. I, well, these cards blow balls on the on the draw. Sure, but what are you this. bringing in? Uh, we're gonna drink bring in uh more spot removal, which is going to be. Uh. uh oh God, do I want the three drop or the three drop? <laughs> I want the three drop. All right. Because it cannot be countered. That, oh, that, they did. They did show us some counter spells. That, yeah, that may. They matter. did show us some counter spells. Okay, you're right. You're right. Uh, revelries, no. Skullcracks, no. Thoughtseize. God, Thoughtseize might actually be good here, man. No, dude, it's not. It sounds really good to me. 
Well, you tell me why. Fetch shake. Fetch shock. Take five. Yeah. On seats. Seems real bad. I can't believe we got out of that game. That was masterful. That was gorgeous. That was oh, good. that's so bad. Mulligan. We're having novel rules. That is not a good look tutelage. for us. It was tutelage. We played a we played a tutelage league. This is a extra game because Mulligan. we had a little bit of extra time. We're playing uh, the deck that we're going to play next week. This is Josh's Black Cute. Lightning. It's um, Black Red Burn in Modern. This is what we're going to be doing next week. This seems fine, right? He may he may be good later on. He's good right here. Cause you're just playing with your blood crypt. You have searing blaze next turn. I'm okay with that. He's probably gonna get bolted though. That's, That's fine. But is he's gonna absorb a bolt? Right. I gotta beat wizards. You gotta beat wizards. I gotta so beat wizards. This is just, just a better wizard player. It's it's like after we played wizards, people started playing wizards at our local scene. Like Donovan <laughs> made cash with wizards. He went four he did. one. He did. No, he went three one. I'm sorry. Oh, lava mancer. Oh, baby, just in time. Seems good. All right, so uh, we're going to. Uh, are you gonna bolt or spike? You know, I think. I think what I'm gonna do is um, so what you're hovering over that bolt. Yeah, I was thinking like lightning bolt a dude, or no, move to attacks, lightning bolt a dude, um, uh huh, and then play a grim lava mancer second main, or I th may just want a searing blaze here and then move to combat. Um, because I think in this spot well, you want I can be the aggressive. Searing, I think the only reason that you would go for the searing blaze is because you're not sure that you're gonna have another fetch land. Yeah. And you can do all that stuff that you want it to do next turn as well. Yeah, so I'm going to go Searing Blaze here. Yeah. All right, so combat. Begin combat. Attack. Okay. Fetch. Fetch, Fetch now? Yeah, because you don't want him to block, right? Yeah, uh, no, I do want him to move the blockers. Okay, well, get your land... if I want to lock myself out of green here just to save life because we're not on the play. It's your call, man. Uh, Turkish command's real good. Yeah, I think it's going to hurt us later. I don't want to do that. Pay through life. Okay. Hit okay against the... No, wait, wait, wait. You said you wanted to let him block. Let him block. Because I don't think he's gonna. Yeah, he didn't block. Go for damage. Blast one of your motherfuckers. Uh... Yeah, I guess. I didn't think about this, but we had the Rakdos choose charm too. Player, planeswalker. Why is it choose target player or planeswalker? Did you know the Searing Blaze can't hit uh, creatures? Did you know that? Since when? Because that's what it says. Okay. Now you choose the now you choose the creature. Because the first target is for the player. It's so stupid. That's why Searing Blaze uh, is just better. For that because it only requires a single target i think damn that tripped me out i've never had to do that before yeah that's why you're gonna get some practice i like this practice i like practice what y'all talking about practice oh baby take that too doesn't matter because we're tapped out <laughs> Double Grim Lava Mancer. Um, Lava Mancer we got Spike two. Attack. Mm. Yeah, Lava Mancer's, uh, mm. Lava Spike. Yeah. John Tutelage. No, sorry for people coming in and, and joining us late. We finished with Tutelage and we moved on to another fun deck. Uh, well, this, well, this is not a fun deck. This is Josh's, uh, Burn deck. He plays, uh, Black Red Burn. 
Junburn, baby. Junburn, sorry, because it has some green in there. Yeah. Alright, so let's move to combat step. Thank you. Give me combat. Don't click it again. Okay, attack. Yeah, so this is, we're just doing a preview of the deck that we're playing next week. Yep. He's going to try and shoot it. Yeah. Um, he's echoing true thing it? Okay, nice. that's fine, right? Yeah, glad he didn't get us with our double Grim Lava Mancer. Walk us. So we're gonna Second main. Okay. Second okay. main, Grim Lava Mancer. Oh, uh, yep. No, no. You guys are super quiet. I only caught, like, half of that. You know Um... I haven't got any audio complaints all day, but it's possible. Yeah. Uh, so we're done with tutelage. We did tutelage earlier. We're just doing a quick showcase of the deck that we're playing next week. This is Josh's um, Jun Burn deck. Did you have sex? Us? I don't know. I'm over here talking to. Uh, yeah, you have sex. To the Lord, to Lord Oni. So smart. So smart. Lava Monster. Build a Lava Monster. Or attack. Pick one. What are you going to do? Uh, hold on. Oh, we, we need to... Uh, yeah, okay, so attack. Wow, I didn't know we... Yeah. Wow, we're running a long time. You're, 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 you're talking a lot. Yeah, you're telling us about the deck and you need to attack. My you're bad. telling us about the deck and that's fine. Okay, I want to bolt before damage. Okay. He's gonna try and deal three damage to your creature. I guess that's fine. So we're we, we're not bolting. No. Okay. But we're playing a lava mancer. We're gonna play a lava mancer. Okay, do that now. Not like that. That's gonna pay life. Right? Yeah, you're right. No, no. Ooh, we are gonna right, so die. You did six through his turn, did you? No, we haven't got to his turn yet. Okay. Because you're going to bolt at some point on his turn, right? Yeah, I'm going to bolt on his turn. I'm yeah. going to bolt his fucking face off. He's going to have that spell pierce again. That's all right. Are we bolting this or are we bolting no. him? No, okay. we're bolting him. Okay. We're on the damage plan. So we're in his end step. Yep, end step. We're going to bolt. End step. Excuse me. Ugh. We're going to try to... We're tr going to try to lava mancer our way to, to victory. Victory! Here. Spike, Lava Mancer, past turn. Or Spike, on his turn, Lava Mancer, and Rakdos turn. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Okay, go for it. Get him. We're just gonna kill him right now. Oh, are we? Yeah, he's at five. Oh, yeah. So you Lava Mancer him now. Right? Yeah. Yay! I gotta get you Moto practice. But other than that, yes. Very yeah. good. Very good. See, the deck's good, man. The deck is good. You don't have to prove it to me. I you got to show it to these guys. I just got to show it to the people. All right, well, it's 5-11, so uh, we got there. We got a, we got another win in for the day with a with a real deck. So um, check us out tonight. Um, and Magic for those After of Dark. You, yeah, Magic After Dark. For those of you that are uh, not following us on uh, on Twitter, um, this is Pando MTG Chris. Hi. I'm Mom's Basement Games, or Mom's Basement MTG. Yep. Uh, follow us on Twitter. Uh, like our page, and then that way you can win a revise pack tonight. Yeah. Uh, don't forget about that. And uh, follow us on Twitch. Yeah, and then you hit, can watch us hit play. Follow on Twitch. Bobby go to Burn. YouTube. Miles Wilson Games on YouTube, yeah. and uh, win a revise pack. Do fun stuff. All right, guys. We, we got to get the hell tonight, out of here, though. And then we will see you tomorrow, or uh, we will see you uh, next week for yeah. Black Lightning. Yeah, tonight is about one one thirty a.m. for Magic After Dark. All right, love you. Bye. Bye.